Hey, Mythic Ninja here. I'm a new channel, so if you could subscribe, that would be amazing. Enjoy the video. In today's video, I have to survive on a submarine in a simulated zombie apocalypse with other people. I will go on land to scavenge for food to survive, reinforce my submarine with more defense systems, and will encounter bandits that want to steal my loot, clans of enemy players that hunt people in cities, and even friendly players that I will help out along the way. Tune in to find out how I will survive for 100 days on a submarine in this zombie apocalypse. Yo, what is up guys? In today's video, we're gonna be surviving on a submarine. Here we go, we are in the ocean. So, uh, let's get this party started. I'm gonna show you the inside of the base real quick. Just go down here in this little hole. There we go. That's the base over here. We got some furnaces, we got a crafting station and a bed. Everything is currently empty and we don't have any loot, but that will change when we meet our next destination. I'm outside of the submarine and here you go guys. As you can see, it's huge. It's really, really big and we are in the middle of the ocean currently on our way to your first destination. I marked on the map a few spots that I should visit to gear myself up and grab some really important materials to survive in the zombie apocalypse. And in the chat it says it's cooling off a little so it is getting maybe a little bit cold. I will head inside and I will see you guys when we get to your first objective. So I think we just arrived. Yep. Yes, we did. Okay, we have a very, very large mountain and some type of ship over there. So, uh, you know me. First things first, I'm gonna go ahead and check out that ship. Because we just spawned in. We are pretty much gearless. It means we don't have anything. Okay, I'm in the water. Here's the submarine. Oh, there is uh, something brewing up. What is that? I hope this isn't a mob and it's just sand falling and like an effect that's coming from it. Oh no, swim up. And it's also raining. Just my luck. Oh, I see our first zombie over there. It's It looks like a policeman. But we gotta be careful. Hopefully no more just spawn in. Because this is day one. It's supposed to be a little bit easier. We have a military zombie over there. Oh, even more zombies. Okay, that's not good. Oh, there we go. There is a sign on it. It says a US Coast Guard. Oh, okay. Let's try and get on this thing. Oh, lightning just hit that zombie. Oh no, that's our first zombie. Get away, get away, get away. Let's quickly just go. Here we are on the boat. How do I get in? Oh, there we go. We are inside. Let's go check this place out. We got a furnace. We got a raw fish. Oh, we got food already. Let's go. Even more MREs. Oh, this is the outside. Let's go inside. Oh, there we go. There's, there it seems to be a hole in, in the ship for some reason. We can loot some place up. Oh, let's go. We got armor and we also have a bandage. I'm gonna put this Coast Guard armor on myself. Let's uh, go deeper. There is another bunk bed. We got a, another bandage and a flashlight. A So now it's not gonna be so dark. Oh, this is a, this is a storage facility. Oh wow, that's a lot of arrows. Another thing. Oh, we got a barrel here. I'm gonna take the bed, one of these beds, just in case. There we go. Calm, so this is the communication. So we got monitors, big chest here. Hey, let's go, we got a gun. It's a magnum. And these are monitors. I'm gonna take these monitors as well, but now we can defend ourselves. Let me see. Does it have ammo in it already? I don't know, I'm not sure. This is an engine switch. Got my flashlight. Okay, I clicked it and uh, there's a lot of pistons at work, but I'm not sure what's happening. I'm gonna turn it off. Because I think this thing is beached. Oh no. Quickly, get the zombie. Okay, luckily it had ammo inside of it. So we do have ammo in it. I think that shot was heard by, an yep, by another zombie. Here he is, he's coming for me. Luckily, these guys die with just one hit in the head. That's good to know. Oh, there's another zombie. Okay, we got him as well. But since it is uh, pretty late and it's also raining, I think we're gonna stay over the night in this little boat. And then we're gonna go ahead and climb that mountain and see if there is anything on the other side. It seems this zombie doesn't have any arms. But that doesn't matter. What is this, by the way, that uh, they drop? What is this? Bionic Neuron. 
What the? I don't know what that is. And there's also plastids. I don't know what this is either. But we are pretty much on the cloud level already. Only a little bit more up. And then we can finally ascend the mountain. Oh. I see some type of building. Uh, doesn't have any windows. That's uh, weird for some reason. But we do have a zombie over here. I'm not going to waste my ammo on it. I'm going to check out this place. The ground looks pretty weird. Like all the vegetation is dead here. We have some construction equipment over there. Whoa. That's, that's a big crane. There aren't a lot of zombies luckily here. So at least that's good. But this place seems pretty desolate. It's like it was abandoned. Whoa. Okay. I'm pretty sure that thing will go down deep. Because this is a big quarry. By the way, I will try and use my bandage to heal myself up. So, uh, my left arm. There we go. I healed it. Let's see if I will replenish any health. I will also eat some canned soup. What's in the truck? Nothing. Oh, no. I think that's the engine. There is a piston in the engine. And if I flip the switch, it's turned on. Not a lot of zombies still. So that's at least something. Let's check this place. If there is a chest here. Nope. No loot. I'm going to heal my left foot. There we go. That should be better. My slowness should reset. And I should be a lot faster. Oh, let's go. We got some chests. We got a crafting table, an iron pickaxe, let's go. A table, a lantern. In this chest we have a, oh, a grappling hook. And more lanterns. I'm gonna take them, but I also hear a zombie. There he is. Let's uh, shoot this guy. Boom. Oh, there is another one right here. Boom. Okay, I'm gonna reload my revolver. I don't have a lot of ammo, so I gotta be careful. Once everybody is in the elevator, pull the lever. Uh-huh, elevator control. Okay. Will it go down? Let me see. Oh. Oh, wow. Oh! It goes even deeper. Wow, this is really deep. Okay. I mean, I do have my grappling hook. Let me see. There's the grappling hook. I'm just gonna test it out to see if it works. Boom. And if I can grapple myself up. Yep, works. It works. Okay. I feel a little bit more safer. Let's uh, try the elevator. Will it work? Oh, okay. Yep, it's working. It's working. Okay. It's descending down, but how long will it descend down for? Because it's uh, a very deep hole. Oh, we got uh, two chests. I wonder, you know what? We do have a pickaxe. Can I Can I break this elevator? Oh, no. It's, is it not fast enough? No, it's not. It's not fast enough. I wanted to grapple out of the elevator and check out the chest. It probably had some good loot in it. We are down in the mine shafts. I call this place the underworld. There aren't many zombies here, but you know what? I don't think I'd like to meet any, any zombies here. There is a mine shaft. Oh, we got a mining helmet. Let's go. I'm going to pick this guy up. Hey, the light isn't broken. Oh, let's go. It literally gives me night vision. I have, a, I have a night vision helmet. That's nice. Looks like a dead end. I'm gonna take this gold. Yep, I'm gonna mine a little. Just to get some, some I don't know, some gear. Oh, let's go. We got barrels. And we have uh, emeralds, deep slate gold ore. I'm gonna take the buckets. Oh, that's another barrel. Okay, another bucket. How big is this mine? It's so huge. A bronze key used to open a locked bronze chest. So we have a key, but I don't know where the chest is. Is that, is that emerald? Okay, we got some zombies. Oh, I missed. Oh, there's uh, more zombies coming up. Okay, there we go. That's two down. Oh, we got another one. Yeah, you thought you were you could hide? You can't hide from me, but I... Oh, I hear more zombies. Okay, there we go. That's another one. I'm gonna reload my uh, magnum. Oh, we got TNT and... And the lever. Okay. I wonder what it will do. <laughs> Let's blow it up. Blow it up. Oh. Okay. We oh we blew you up an entrance and there are some levers. Oh no. What's happening? My night vision is ending. But I have a night vision helmet. What will happen? Damn it. The light on the helmet went out. Oh, okay. So there is no more light on the helmet. I think it's time for the <laughs> the flashlight. The flashlight comes back. We have some type of vendor here. Ooh. 
a little hidden, you could say, barrel with a coin. We got two more barrels, more coins, and the morphine. Okay, doesn't look like there is anything here. I'm gonna head on out, I think, because uh, I think this is the end. Go, go, go. This is the elevator. Elevator control. Okay, let's uh, let's go up. But first of all, first of all, how high are we or how deep are we? Okay, it is nighttime, I, s I think, I see. And uh, it's gonna take a few minutes to go back up. But we are so deep. Actually, you know what? Can I use my uh, grappling hook? I think, I think I can. And it's even more fun. But I'm not doing it because it's fun, guys. In reality, the elevator is so slow, it's pretty much insane. So, uh, this is my best bet to come up faster. I also want to get that chest in the middle. And if we just go like this... Oh, okay, never mind. Final hook right here. Okay, okay, that's, that's not what I wanted. Can we, uh, can we jump up? Boom. Ah, oh, there we go. We, we finally did it. We got diamonds. Hey, let's go. I'm gonna get these diamonds. That's one diamond. We got more emeralds. Lapis lazuli. We also have a magma cube backpack. Oh, that's actually nice. Can we equi equip it? Put it on my back. There we go. Oh, looks real nice. Looks real nice. And that means I can also place a lot of stuff, a, lo a lot of the stuff that I don't need inside of it. I'm gonna get the buckets, the crafting table, some food, arrows, and morphine. Okay, that that should be it. Let's uh, let's go back to the submarine. It's finally morning, and we are still up really high on the mountain. I just found some of these buildings, and I want to quickly check them out if there is any loot. So there is a bathroom, room number one. Anything in these things? Doesn't look like it. Oh, this door is boarded boarded up. Is there a zombie maybe here? Doesn't look like it. We got a monitor. Oh, what's in the barrel? Nothing good. Okay, I'm pretty sure this place doesn't have uh, a lot of loot. And I also hear zombies. So, uh, yeah, let's, uh, let's just go. Go back to the submarine before these zombies literally swarm me. Uh, I feel so safe to be back in my submarine. Hopefully there is uh, no zombies actually on it, but we are back. Okay, so we just checked out that boat over there, climbed this mountain, checked out a mining facility or something like that. We got some good loot, but it's not good enough. This is junk. It's, it's It really is. The best loot will be in the city, so I think that will be our next objective. Okay, let's see. We have a scaffolding table. I don't know what it's for. Oh, it's for uh, getting stuff from the dirt blocks, I think, or something like that. And is this it? I think it is. We got another bed. We got some monitors and a crafting table. Let's go. I'm going to put the crafting table here. Put a, I don't know, a monitor here. Can this, can this be a TV? <laughs> I don't know if this can be a TV. Let's see. We are outside. We are in the ocean again, and uh, as I said before, our next objective will be to go into the city for better loot, because look at me. I'm in mining gear and stuff like that. I have a magnum. This is everything I have. It's not enough. I need better gear. So yeah, we will go into the city. I will see you guys when we finally get there. Let's see. Oh, yep. We did arrive, I think, somewhere. I see land, a port, I think. Let me just back off real quick to see what this thing is. Is this a big bridge? Whoa. Okay, this is huge. This is a huge bridge. Oh, we have another boat over there. It looks like a yacht or something. Uh, probably when the zombie apocalypse hit, a lot of people that had boats, they just went out into the sea and probably ran out of supplies or something or fuel for the yacht. And now it's uh, over there just standing empty. I just crafted myself a boat. Let's see, I'm gonna jump in, place it. Let's uh, let's go check out the land. Here is our submarine and it's looking huge. It is really huge. Okay, doesn't look like there's any movement on the port. Oh, I see a ladder. I'm gonna use that to get up. 
I do have a Magnum, but I don't have a lot of ammo for it left, so it will be pretty dangerous if we do meet some zombies. Okay, the ladder is broken, so I'm gonna have to use my uh, grappling rope. There we go. There we go. That's better. Way better. Okay, so uh, I don't I don't see anybody still. Oh, this is a big train. Oh, we do have zombies coming from inside of the building. I'm gonna shoot it. Let's go. How how do I get up? Oh, there's a ladder here on the side, and there's a chest. Let's go. We got a we got a hollow scope and the medium bullets. The bullets are not for this gun, but you know what? Can I equip a scope on it? Ah, uh, no, I can't. Okay, I cannot use the scope on the revolver. Oh, there was a zombie inside of this place. I'm gonna just close the door. There's a lot of chests, but it looks like junk, to be honest. All of it. I mean, I'm gonna take the paintings, I guess, for the base to make it look a little bit better. And by the base, I mean, uh, I, I mean the submarine. Let's go. I'm gonna pick up a crate. Okay, seems like this is it. Let's go outside. Okay, there is a zombie with no arms. Oh, there's another zombie inside. Let's uh, quickly just get it. There's a lot of zombies. Oh no! What is this? The control room. Oh, okay, I see. I'm gonna block myself in. There we go. Oh, okay. There we go. I got the little zombie. That was quick. Oh, there is a chest here and some levers. Let's see. Do the levers do anything? No, I don't think they do, but... Oh, there, there is a lot of zombies here. There is a lot of zombies here. And there is a chest. Let's see what's in the chest. We got bandages. <gasps> let's go. We got a gun. It's an M4A4. And we got bullets. Is it, yes. Let's go. It's the right type of ammo. It's the right type of ammo. Let's go. I'm going to reload it. Oh, time to test this baby out. Oh. Oh, okay. It's perfect. I'm not going to waste too much ammo. Can I equip a scope on this thing? Yes, I can. Oh, it zooms it in a little bit. That's so nice. I see an iron door over there. I think I'm gonna make a run for it. But we just have to get rid of a few zombies here. Okay, go, go, go. Go, go, go. Run, run, run. Away from the zombies. Whew. There we go. We are safe. There's a zombie here. There we go. The damage on the gun is actually pretty good. I'm not complaining. I think it's like three body shots. And let me see if it's a headshot. Then that's... And it's two shots, okay. We are on this bridge. I'm just gonna reload my weapons real quick. There are no zombies, so that's good. But we should be coming soon to your submarine. I'm gonna use my grappling hook to grapple down there. And then we maybe go, go deeper into the city. Because the city is that way and we just came from over there. That's, that's the ocean. There is nothing on that side. Ooh. Looks like there was some type of accident on the bridge because it looks like the road is kind of broken. The bridge is a little bit broken. Okay, this is pretty high, but I think we can do this. I just have to grapple. Now, you know what? If I'm gonna fall, I'm gonna fall. I would rather fall into the water. So let's go. I'm gonna go ahead and... Whoa! Okay, there we go. I'm just gonna swing. Now I just have to descend down. Please don't fall. Please don't fall. No. This is literally the highest. This is the highest I can descend down to. I think I have to fall. Okay. One, two, three. Ooh. Oh. Oh, okay. Okay. It's not that bad. It's not ba that bad. Just climb up. Let's, uh, let's go back into the submarine and be on our way, I guess. Uh, it feels so much safer here. So much safer. Coming up, we are finally on our next destination. Look at this. We are in the city. And if I, if I can say so, we are literally in the middle of the city. But uh, we just stopped here. Let's see. Uh, I think the best way to get on land would be uh, not to scale these large walls, but to uh, use our grappling hook. And let's see, can I can I hook it up to that bridge over there? Yes, I can. Okay. Now if I just climb up, 
Oh, yeah, that's so sick. Can I, uh, can I, I wonder, can I climb these vines or should I better just continue scaling up with my grappling hook? Okay, jump. There we go. We are, we are here. We are finally here. We did it. So, the bridge is a little bit broken, but that doesn't matter. Hopefully, there are no zombies nearby, and it looks like we are in the clear at the moment. Warning! Radiation ahead, do not answer without mask. Ooh, okay, so we gotta be careful around these places, because uh, there is radiation. I'm just running across the bridge to the city, but, but it seems that it's been walled off, and there is a large tank that just kind of crashed into the wall. I'm gonna try and scale it and see if there is uh, any good loot maybe in the building. So we got a zombie over there. We also gotta be careful with the bandits. So uh, let's get the zombie real quick. Okay, got him. That's good. Let's just walk about and uh, see if we can find anything. This place looks like it was a brewery because we got some empty glasses. I mean empty bottles. Yeah, just empty bottles, nothing else. We also got a lot of books, computer screens. What does it say? Employees only, huh? Okay. Employees only it is. I'm an employee. <laughs> Brewing lab. Oh, that's where they made all the all the stuff they're selling. Okay, that's cool, that's cool. The door, it seems, was... Uh, broken through but let's just go up and see if we can find anything else so it seems that this building is huge but uh, we got some we, we got some I, I think these are office spaces let's see if there is any loot on these uh, oh what is this it's 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 not a barrel okay I thought there were uh, these things were barrels we just have to loot up Ooh, can I jump over this to the next building I hope I can. Let's go. I'm gonna climb up. Okay, I'm gonna break. Oh, no, no, no. Climb up, climb up. I have to uh, shoot this glass to break it. Okay, there we go. I broke the glass. Now, if we can go in. There we go. We are inside this building. Ooh, it seems we found some type of large building. Looks like a mall, to be honest. But there's also a chest here. Let me see. Oh, we got raw chicken. Okay. We got raw chicken. Oh, by the way, we gotta be careful around this uh, the city. Because there may be zombies inside of these buildings. And they may be making a little trap for us. Okay, I'm coming in. Oh, there's a chest here. We got some apples. Oh, emergency flares. That's, that's so sick. That is so sick. What does it say? Mall closed due to outbreak. Go around. Well, it seems someone didn't go around or the zombies must have broken through. Oh, there is there is one zombie. I got him. I think maybe that's it. Hopefully that's it. Okay. Okay, it seems we are in the clear. So what do we have in these barrels? We got first floor directory. So we got, we got maps. We got maps of... Uh, the layout of the building. I don't see... Oh, I see a chest over there. I'm gonna go ahead and try and pick it up. I'm gonna scale like this. The little wall over. Okay, let's see. We got emergency flares, bandages, apples. I'm gonna take the apples. And let's turn on the flashlight. So what do we have here? We have a mall directory, a go game, deluxe. A lot of signs. We have so many signs. Another chest. We got survivor's notes. Ooh, what does it say? We need more food. I am so close to eating the weeds in this nasty fountain. Oh, no. Is, is, is there... Oh, yeah, there is actually weeds growing in the fountain. Okay. Someone was uh, starving. I, f I see that we came across a survivor camp, from what it looks like, with a skeleton skull. And uh, 
some blood, which is uh, in reality just redstone. <laughs> we got another office over here, but uh, okay. Let's see if I can find anything else. Oh, we got a zombie with no arms. I'm gonna use my pistol ammo, not to waste too much ammunition, to be honest. Okay, we are clear. This is security. What does that mean? Whoa, okay, that's that's a big computer setup. Whoever was behind this PC, he was playing some cool, cool PC games with so many monitors. We got another fountain. We got a toilet. Oh, I think this is a shop. That's cool. Let's see if there is anything inside. We got we got a poisonous potato. I mean raw chickens. Yes, I'm gonna take the raw chickens. Ooh, a power glider. That's literally uh, like a parachute, I think. It'll allow us to go jump from the from the buildings. That's gonna be so sick. I don't need to heal up any of my legs or arms, that's good. But I do hear zombies. Register closed. Oh, we have a chest and... Oh, we got a gun! It's an FN2000. It takes the same bullets that uh, the M4 takes. And we also have a mine pop, a zombie mine pop. Whoa, okay. Well, let me see, is this like a collectible? Oh, I, I can't place it? I, I don't think I can place it down. Oh no, I can, okay. I just had to uh, stop carrying the flashlight. Whoa. This is like a mine pop, but, but in real life they're called Funko Pops. That's so cool, it's like a mini collectible of a zombie in a zombie apocalypse. I mean, we're gonna take it. It's gonna be a nice addition to the base. But uh, let's check out the gun. So, uh, it seems that it has already ammo inside, but uh, can I uh, can I add any attachments to it? Oh, I don't even know if it's better than the M4, to be honest. The M4 is kinda nice. Closed due to flooding. Hmm, but there is a chest over there. Let's see what's in the chest. If there is anything good, I would be surprised, but no, there's just cobwebs, spider eye. Oh, there is a hidden chest over here. Maybe we... Nope, never mind. Hidden chest, not hidden chest, it's all the same. Oh, whoa. There is a basement, it seems. Uh, there is a basement to this building. Oh, whoa. Are we... Are we in, like, the underground metro? Oh, oh, oh no. We got zombies. I'm gonna use my new gun. Oh wow, it's so powerful. I got another zombie. And there's a double chest here with some last hope. And uh, food, name tags, fishing rods. What does this book say? This is for anyone who stumbles into my makeshift hideout. If you're reading this, you're either standing right next to me or I'm no longer around. Ooh. Stay safe, traveler. Keep moving and stay out of the city during the night. So the guy said in the book that there is uh, bandits roaming around causing havoc, but I think that was maybe a few years ago because there aren't a lot of survivors left this time, at this time. Door locks, hold up, so this will close the door? Oh, I don't, I don't think it does because uh, the redstone is broken. Oh, I hear zombies, but I don't know where from. This is also a nice little garden underground, underground of the mall, that's pretty dope, but oh, oh, that's a zombie, okay. I thought that was like a, I don't know, a statue or something, he didn't look real, but it is a zombie. Hey, come here, zombie, I'm gonna tap you with a headshot. What were you protecting? Looks like a tunnel. What will we have here? Oh, oh, what's, uh, what's, be what's behind that door? Oh, it's a metro. Oh, there's a lot of zombies. Okay, I'm gonna get this guy. Get this guy. Okay, I missed one headshot. That was a wasted bullet. 
Let's go. I'm gonna use my use my new gun. Oh, I think I like it. It's actually really fast. It shoots the bullets so fast. The train, I'm pretty sure, is not running anymore because this thing is literally broken. But we do have another flooded, uh, flooded place here. And what is this? Oh, whoa. I think this is a sewage system that's uh, collapsed on itself. And we see that it's also nighttime. But this is a sewage system. And that's really dope. I think this is the place where the zombies would uh, go to you last. So if I was in a real zombie apocalypse, I'd probably hide in that place. But luckily, I do have a submarine. So the submarine is, in fact, better. We got another zombie over there. I'm not gonna. Oh, I'm not gonna get these zombies. I'm just gonna close the door real quick. Yeah, there we go. Now you can't get me, guys. You cannot get me. Okay, let's get back to the mall. Oh, no, 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 please, please. Okay, there we go. We can't get infected because I don't have any antibiotics yet. This place is huge. What is this? It's a market. Are there any chests? Nope, no chests. This place is so huge. Closed until further notice. What? Or are these supposed to be cars? <laughs> they look so goofy. Let's go up. Is this the way we came from? Ah, uh, I don't think it is. Oh, we got a barrel with rolled up posters. I'm gonna take a few. A chest with keep behind counter at all times. We got high heels, a notice, some some sticks, and money. A <laughs> paper, which is just named the money. Go to main entrance. This place is blocked off. Huh, it seems we are closed off. Have to uh, circle around. Okay. Oh! It's also getting pretty late. So we do have to be careful. Because the zombies, they increase their numbers when it's... Uh, when it's night time. Oh, we got another chest here. Let's go. We got a stock, a tactical silencer, and long bullets. I don't have any any gun that takes long bullets, but uh, let me see. Can I put a silencer on this gun? Because it is a little bit loud. And I can't put a stock on it, but... Uh, whoa. Whoa, that's really silenced. That is so silenced. But how will this uh, silencer sound on an M4? Ooh, even better. Okay, that uh, with a silencer like this, no zombies will ever hear us. And also no bandits, so that means we're gonna be literally safer. But I don't know if it's uh, it's gonna make less damage, because it is uh, silenced. Silenced weapons usually do less damage over the distance. I think I'm gonna use my grappling hook to get to the rooftop, so I could... Oh no, climb up, climb up, climb up. I'm getting infected by these zombies. There we go, I got him. I'm gonna go to the, uh, to the top floor. Uh, uh, there we go, we made it. I don't see anyone. So I think we are pretty much safe. I'm gonna spend the night here and uh, when it's daytime, we're gonna continue on our way. And explore the city a little bit more because it is so huge and there's bound to be some good loot that we can find here. Ooh, there's a hidden chest. And we got a, a book, some spruce planks. Ah, I'm gonna take them just, just in case. I'm also gonna take the torches, but let's go. We are on a rooftop as you can see guys. It's a brand new day. And I want to check out something. I want to check out my paraglider. Now, will it work or will I fall to my death? Newsflash, I already tested out a little bit on, on not a, such a high ground. And it does work. So, uh, I'm just going to show it to you guys for the first time on cam. Let's go. Whoo! There we go. Look at that. That is so cool. That is so cool. So, now we will never fall to your death if we can just open up the glider. 
Oh, there is a chest over there. Let's go. Happy birthday. Huh. So uh, someone was celebrating their birthday here? What is this? What does it mean? Let's go. We got a... Oh, we got a cake. And we have an AWM. I think that's a sniper. I really think that's a sniper. And we have a zombie over there. Just just in the nick of time. Hey, let... Oh. Oh, let's go. It even has a scope. Okay. Let's uh, test it out on this zombie. I'm gonna use uh, the sniper to get a headshot. Ooh, that's a one shot, one kill. Let's go. The floor of the building also looks like it uh, it collapsed. And uh, yeah, there was maybe a library under all this stone. But uh, now there is no library. It's just, uh, it's just uh, I don't know, a mess. It's a mess. You need a flashlight always in the buildings, because uh, you never know uh, when... Uh, uh, there is no electricity. There is no electricity in the zombie apocalypse, guys. So, uh, you always gotta have it. I'm also trying to scope out and see if I can find any zombie hordes, because zombie hordes are pretty dangerous in the terms of that they can overwhelm the player very easily, and if we're not careful and not literally on a lookout for them all all the time we can run into one accidentally and that'll be it that'll be gg oh we have a crevice underground i don't know what this is let me see oh that's another that is another sewage system that is so cool L let's go over there because uh, i think there is something over there in that side oh it's uh it makes a turn to the left, and we can also go up, but you know what? I'm not gonna go up, I'm gonna continue going, just to see where it leads to. Oh, this is so spooky. This is so spooky, not kidding guys, not kidding. Switch systems, there is always something scary about them. Like a big zombie is gonna pop out, out of nowhere. Whoa. Whoa, okay. Definitely do not want to go down there. That's a really deep hole. Oh, check this out. I think we came back to the submarine, maybe? Because that, that thing over there, that's that's a submarine and that's the bridge. Oh, that, that is so sick. Okay, but can we get there? There uh, appear to be some doors over here, so let's check them out. Yep, this path is also blocked off so let's see if there is anything we gotta crouch under here to get past insert key card uh do i have to insert a key card or can i insert just an apple an apple what it took it and it didn't give me anything come on dude you, you can't be serious what if i break this yeah there we go uh, they didn't think i'd have a Iron pickaxe. <gasps> no, my flashlight went out. My my literal flashlight went out. I don't have any batteries. Oh no no, I do I do have a. Oh that's a small battery. It's not gonna last for long. But you know what? Better than nothing, I guess. Let's uh, turn it on. There we go. Okay, so we we got the batteries again. That was a close call. I think I will need to raid a uh, engineering el electronics shop or something like that for more batteries. We got cobwebs, we also have these chests with... What the? What is this? 20% plus speed and also resistance. We have a potion. Boom. I drank it. There's a flare gun. Oh, okay. The potion was a little bit, a little bit weird. I think it was expired. Room for a computer. Removed due to mass theft. Oh, okay, so uh, the computer has been removed because people were stealing it in the zombie apocalypse. Vent duct number 7, status unknown, repairs needed, click to unlock. You hear the sound of screeching metal, then a loud bang. The monitor flashes success before going blank. Okay, I did something. Uh, it said in the chat, but I'm not sure what. Vent duct number 7. Let's go, I'm gonna go ahead and try and find a vent duct number 7. 
Danger Deep Drop, is it? Ooh. Okay. Don't want to fall in there. What is this? Look how deep an elevator can go. This is a single floor demo. This elevator is just an example. I don't, I don't get it. What does it mean? What does it mean? Tour is not over. Check out the generator and air filtration and we got the bedrooms. Oh, that's where the workers probably slept. We also have some chests with... Uh, let me see. I don't have any boots. And can I find a helmet? Yes, there we go. That's a helmet. Anything else? Okay, it seems not. So let's equip the helmet and the boots. Where are the boots? There we go. There we go. So now we are a little bit more geared. I know I don't look really cool because I have a Magnum. I don't have an RPG. But you know what? It's, it's good enough, I guess. By the way, can we break through this wall to kind of, you know, go around the stuff that's being caved in through that tunnel? Let me see, if I just break this cobblestone, will I get to the other side? Oh, I see something, but I don't know what I'm seeing. Okay, so we did go through the tunnel somehow. Oh, we got zombies. We got zombies everywhere. Uh, let me get my let me get my M4. Okay, there we go. We got them all. Is is that all? I th I think it is. I think it is for this area. I am on the bridge already. It's still uh, nighttime, so I will go to the submarine and. Uh, I will get inside, we'll sleep over the day, I mean the night, and then I will, uh, I guess, go ahead and onto your next objective, which is gonna be pretty cool, because it's a new city that's just been unlocked, and I don't know if it's, I don't know if it's habitable, if there are any survivors there, but that's probably our best bet, okay, uh, to find survivors and even a zombie cure, maybe. But uh, here we go, that's the submarine, I'm gonna jump into the water, okay, there we go. Damn, the submarine is huge. It's, it really is huge. But let's get inside. I'll see you guys in the next in the, in the next location. What if I fire a flare gun during the day? Is that a... That, that's not a flare. That is not a flare. This is useless. Yeah. Useless, I say. And uh, let me see. I do have actual flare guns. Yeah, there we go, emergency flare, but it's just the uh, fireworks, I guess, but can I, boom, can I shoot them? Ah, oh, that is so nice, that is so cool, okay, so when it's night time, and uh, I don't know, we gotta scare off a zombie horde, we can actually go ahead and use it to, I don't know, control the zombie horde, I guess. But let's go inside of the base, so... As you can see, guys, we have a, a few more things. A few more things we can add to the base. For example, a double bed. It's it's a different color, so it doesn't work. Never mind. How about a painting? Yeah, just two paintings like this. So much better. We also have another crafting table and a crate. The crate will house all the things that are... I don't know. I don't know what plastids and rotten flesh I can I can use it for. So uh, I don't know what I can use it for. But there we go. We have another Funko Pop. I'm gonna place it right here on this table. Looking good. Looking real good. I need to also craft myself a chest because I, I noticed that I don't have any chests. I'm gonna place it right here. I do have a barrel, but I don't know. I think I need more space. By the way, my M4, it literally actually uh, can use a stock. Oh no, stock is not applicable, so I cannot change the stock because look at this. It already comes with a stock at the back. So, I have a basic stock and I don't know what I can use it for. Can I put it on the... Nope, I can't put it on the sniper as well because it already comes with a stock. And this, this baby right here also doesn't need a stock, so it's pretty useless, I think. Now, would you look at that? We just came across, I think that's an oil rig? 
Yeah, uh, I think that's an oil rig. I got my boat ready and uh, let's go ahead and check this thing out. There is our submarine. As you can see guys, it's looking huge per usual. But uh, let me see, what is this? Oh, whoa, there's a lot of junk just floating in the distance. Just above water, there's all types of things. A cartography table, a smithing table. I think there was some kind of accident on the oil rig. I got an achievement, oil heck yeah. Is Oh no, look at that, it's literally broken. Half of the oil rig has just collapsed. I don't know if that was because of an explosion or maybe the zombie apocalypse or a tsunami. We're gonna have to find out, but this is looking pretty dangerous. Oh, what was that? What did just fall from the ground? What is that? Something just fell from above? I don't know what that was. Okay, I'm just gonna use my grappling hook. I wonder, can I reach the floor of that oil rig? Let's go. Yes, I did it. Okay, let's go. Now, all, all we have to do is just climb up. Climb up, climb up. Oh, okay. I have to swing myself up and then climb up. Hopefully. Oh, it's pretty difficult to do this because... Because it literally, when it doesn't allow you to jump over the block when you hooked it up pretty bad, that's that's a GG. I, I think I'll have to land on the floor below. Ugh, there we go. Whew, there we go, I did it. Okay. Let's turn on the flashlight. Oh, the oil rig isn't as big as I thought it would be. Luckily, I also don't see a lot of zombies here. But, uh, whoa. It is... Uh, Pretty high. It's pretty high. So dangerous. And just when I was talking about zombies, I hear I hear a sound of a zombie. I also don't know how to get up. Oh, I think I saw the zombie over there. I'm gonna take out my magnum. Where are you, zombie? Okay, uh, he's not here. Never mind. Oh! Whew. Okay, so uh, I wasn't wrong. There was an actual zombie. I don't know how I can get up on another floor. Wait, is that a safety boat? I think it is. I don't know how I can get up to the other floor. I think I'll have to just grapple again. Let's go. I'm gonna... Oh, I'm gonna try to hit the grapple over there. There we go. Just climb up slowly. Yes, you can do it. Okay, we are on a floor above. But I need to get rid of this. I need to get rid of this guy. There we go. Got rid of them. Let's see if there is anything on this floor. Oh, another zombie. Got it as well. Okay. Gotta be careful. Gotta be careful. Because the zombies, they, they can be pretty dangerous. Turn on the flashlight. I'm not gonna waste ammo on the slow zombies. This one it looks like it's a little bit slower. Let's see. Can I climb up to the very top? It's cooled off a little. My uh, my player in the in the chat says that that it's cooling off, and I know that it's kind of cold, maybe because we are in the middle of the ocean, so there's probably big winds, and it's really cold. Oh, I see a ladder. Let's go. Let's go. We found a ladder. Now we can just go. Oh, there is a zombie waiting for us there. And I'm also gonna get getting swarmed by zombies over here. Let's go get a pickaxe. Ah! <laughs> okay, get that zombie. Quickly break break the break the trap door. We gotta go up. We gotta go up. We cannot be squeezed from the from below and above with these zombies. Oh whoa, their aggro range is insane. Go, go, go back. Where are they at? Where are they at? I know I know you're here, little zombie. Oh. Okay. I think they have a field of vision. Oh! No! No, no, no! I'm getting bit! I'm getting bit! There we go. I got these zombies. Okay. That's what I was saying. It's very dangerous if the zombies bite you sometimes, because then you're blinded. They can break your legs, break your arms, so you can't build or mine. And if they break your legs, you run really slowly. 
And if they get your vision and you're swarmed by a bunch of them, that's GG's. So we gotta be really careful. I think I need to bandage also my, uh, my head, yeah. My head just had a little bit of a trauma, because I think I had some black vision. So that's why it was uh, shaking. Let's go, what do we have here? Let me see. Looks like, uh, looks like it was blocked off by some people. I'm gonna take all of these uh, tools, to be honest. Take the smithing table, table, the cutting, cutting board, and also the smoker. What is this? I think this is a, oh, is that a key? Is that a key? Tell me it is. Tripwire hook. No, it's not a key. Never mind. Let's go. I hear a ton of zombies, but you know what? Ooh. Oh, okay, never mind. That was a tower. I thought that was a zombie. I just want to see quickly if there is any loot here, and if there is not, then we're going to be on our way. But the oil rig is so interesting that we came across it in the ocean just randomly by going to your next objective. Because I never expected that I, I would find these large structures even in the ocean. That's so crazy. Okay, I'm going to have to use a grappling hook. Let's go. So we got on a level above. Oh, okay. We got some zombies here. I'm going to use my sniper. Oh, that's a really powerful sniper. I see a ton of zombies. But uh, I'm, I'm just... I don't know, saving ammo. I think the sniper shots, they, uh, they're one shot, one kill. So that's probably us saving on ammunition. Ooh. Whoa, this guy is in the window. That's real creepy. That's real creepy. Let's go inside that building. Yo, anyone home? We got a bunch of, a bunch of balls and weights on the floor. And also a ladder going up and down. I'm gonna go up and see if I can clear this zombie that was looking at me through the window. Yes, there we go. <gasps> this is a control deck. All of these pressure gauges and stuff like that. It's a control deck. I mean, it's supposed to be one. It's uh, pretty nice, to be honest. I don't see any chests in the safety uh, safety boat. I thought there would be a chest there with like uh, a first aid med pack or something like that. Because, you know, it's an emergency lifeboat. But seems there is nothing there. Okay. Oh, we got another zombie. Quickly get it. Okay, let's go. Let's go. I think I'm going to get to the to the very top of the oil rig and then I'm going to sleep the night. I think my right foot is also busted because I'm pretty much walking really slowly it should heal over time but let's uh let's go oh there we go the the grappling hook it scares me sometimes okay i think this is a place as good as any to uh get the bed going so let's place a torch another tor torch like this and let's get the bed to be honest I like to sleep on the edge, so uh, to get the bed, I think I have to do this like that. Boom. I'm gonna use the backpack bed this night, because I think, I don't know, I don't want to place a bed in the ocean. I just want to try and use my backpack, because it has this functionality. It has a bed built in. Why not use it? So since it is nighttime, I'll see you guys when it's daytime, and we're probably gonna be... On our next objective already, we... Oh, I just saw a zombie fall. I, oh, there is another zombie over there. Okay, I'm gonna quickly dispatch of it. There we go. Easy, easy. Okay, guys, I'll see you when it's daytime. And uh, we're gonna... We're gonna see what next objective we can reach. So, we are back. It's a brand new day. That's also the oil rig in the distance. It looks pretty cool, if I say so. Uh, really cool, but it is time to go, so uh, let's go see if we can get to our next destination. Whoa, we just came across another random structure in the ocean, and I think this one is even cooler. If my map is correct, this may be the Alcatraz. I 
I just crafted a boat. Let's see if we can actually go visit it. So let's go. This is the actual Alcatraz. This is pretty nuts that I can actually visit it. But that also means that we are nearing some type of city or civilization. Because if I'm not mistaken, Alcatraz is actually really close to an actual city in real life. So here we are. Let me just uh, get, my, get my boat. There we go. Let's see if we can check this place out. I don't hear any zombies or see them at least. So that's at least something good at the moment. I'm gonna have to go through this place. But you see guys, the barbed wire. I think we have to find the main entrance. And I really don't know where it's at. Okay, I've been walking around for quite some time. So uh, I think I found a hole in the wall which I can use to go into the prison, but I have to I have to get over this wire and for that I will use my grappling hook. So let's go. Let's hope that it sticks. There we go. Now if I just climb over the barbed wire, whoa, that's pretty insane to be honest. There we go. Ooh, we did it. Let's just get these zombies real quick. I found a rooftop that's been a uh, crevice, you could say. But also... Oh, whoa, this is the Alcatraz. Oh, we got the gym. Whoa, okay. And we also got the basketball court. And I don't know what that is. Oh, must be a garden or something. We got a security camera over there. There it is. And... Uh, we also got some zombies. I'm gonna try and see if I can snipe them out from this distance. Let me see. I'm gonna zoom it in. Zoom it in again. Okay, I've got a clear shot. Oh, did I get him? Oh, oh no. I think a zombie just hit me off the rooftop for some reason. But yeah, I got the zombie. Check it out. There's the XP on the ground. I'm gonna reload my sniper. Was that you, zombie? <laughs> no, probably not. It was a zombie on the... On the on the rooftop. There we go, we got this zombie. There must be a lot of zombies in this place because it's kind of uh, isolated. And that means, that means that these people, they couldn't run away from the zombie apocalypse. But luckily there are a lot of cameras, so that should keep us safe. My objective here is to actually try and find a, a storage facility for the officers where they held all the guns they had. If, if we can get a shotgun, that would be pretty dope. Oh, another zombie. There we go. Got him. There we go. We got this one. Oh, we got even more zombies. Okay, okay. Uh, nothing in the... Oh, there is a piece of armor hidden in the bed of some prisoner. But uh, from... Oh, what, what it looks like... It looks like there isn't, to be honest, a lot of armor or any chests, I mean, in these, uh, in these prison, prison rooms. So where will the officers keep their guns to, you know, control the prisoners and stuff? It will probably somewhere in a very locked, locked building. Probably close to these prison cells, but maybe on this floor, but not beside them. What if we go up? Oh, we got even more prisons. Okay, even more prison cells. Oh, we got a room. This looks promising. Nope, just prison showers. I also lost my backpack. I mean, my uh, flashlight. So that means... That means we're walking with a torch now. But I don't see... I don't I don't really understand the layout, uh, layout of the prison. It's uh, pretty weird. Look at this, we're literally outside already. Oh, call elevator. I don't think I can call it. I think it's a little bit broken. A little bit. But if we go down, is there a floor here? Yes, there is. Okay. Oh, we got more zombies gonna reload the rifle oh okay no 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 get away get away get away there we go 
gonna collect the XP, go run, run, run. Since it's night time, the zombies are gonna punch for a little bit more than they usually punch, and that's not good. So we gotta be really careful. We got zombie heads, we got blood on the floor. Okay, we gotta be real careful. This looks like a kitchen. I'm gonna take these, uh, gonna take these raw and cooked prison foods. Oh, we got a fish. Let's go. Hmm, I'm gonna throw out this stuff. There we go. That's better. Get the torch. Place it in my hand. Oh, we got a trap door. Look at this. And oh, we have a switch. It's ooh. I just heard some pistons. I literally just heard some pistons. Yeah, okay, that means something is literally happening. This one doesn't do anything. So let me see. Oh, okay, we got uh, we got we got these guys. Let me just quickly get rid of them. Hmm. Looks really Oh. Oh. Is this it? I think it is. I think it is. We just found a secret, some kind of tunnel, maybe? A prison tunnel? Oh! It's like secret tunnels, okay. The prisoners, they must have been digging this place out. It's pretty nuts, pretty nuts. Let me see, so we got cartography tables. We got these collectors. Okay. I think I'll get my M4 out, because I, I don't have a shotgun. But this is pretty close range, and if a zombie really pops out, I want to really get rid of it fast ASAP. Don't continue to dig this way. Okay, don't continue to dig this way. Why? Is there something here? Let me see. I'm gonna break these blocks, see if there is anything on the other side. I've been digging for a little bit, and I, I don't know. I, I think they meant don't dig this way because it's literally nothing. So let's uh, let's go back and uh, let's go check out the other route. But this is so cool. I think this is literally the prisoners. They were making their escapes. Oh, there is a chest here. What does the chest have? A prisoner tool, spoon, a prisoner tool. Wood piece. Used to make the grappling hook. Oh, okay. But we already have a grappling hook. So wh what do you mean? <laughs> I mean, this is so cool. So the prisoners were trying to make an escape by digging the, a dirt tunnel with spoons. That's so crazy. And it's also so crazy that we found it. It was like such a well-kept secret. What if we go down here? Will we see anything? <gasps> I think I see a window? You cannot be real. <gasps> this is the window to the outside. I think they literally... We're nearly out of the out of the prison. Oh, that's so cool. So if we break these things, boom, we are out. Oh, look at that. You can even see that they were trying to break the, the metal wall because it's uh, like one bar only. Okay, so we're tracing the footsteps of these guys. And what is this? There is an axe. In a fish, in a tuna. An umbrella. Oh, we got a barrel. With a mushy food, fishing rod. You know what? I'll take the fishing rod, to be honest. Because, why not? That's a zombie. I'm going to snipe him. Got to be really careful. I'm going to scale this, uh, one of these lookout towers, just to see where I'm at. Because I really want to find the officer's lounge where they keep all the goodies. Okay, we are on the top, and I see a light. I don't know if that's if that light is uh, it means there's electricity or is it just so the ships wouldn't break, uh, wouldn't run into the Alcatraz Island? But look at that. That's our submarine in the distance. It's pretty chill. Oh, we got a zombie. Oh, oh, it disappeared. What the? Okay. We got another zombie here. I'm gonna run and shoot. Oh, that's so sick. Okay, so the accuracy doesn't get worse even if we run. Got another zombie over there. There we go. Got him. Oh, 
we got even more zombies. I think they they're attracted to the shots. So you know what? I think I'm not gonna waste any ammo. I'm climbing up a tower and I hear zombies. Oh, we are finally here. Oh, two zombies. That's one. That's two. Okay, we are finally on one of the radio towers, I think. These ones are literally the tallest structures. So uh, I literally went through the whole prison. I saw solitary confinement cells, normal cells, everything. So, yeah. Oh, emergency use only. Hey, let's go. Is that a... Oh, that's a shotgun. I, I thought we'd get a sniper rifle in, in the tower, but never mind. We have a diamond helmet, maybe like some safety, safety precaution thing. And we also have a grappling hook that's rocket propelled. Huh. Is it is it better than my grappling hook? Let me let me check. And what does rocket mean? Oh by the way, we, we got a gun. Let me let me let me check it out. How does the gun look? Is it good? Oh, the world just uh, regened. That means uh, that means the seasons just changed. So it will be a little bit colder, maybe. The autumn is starting. So as you can see, the grass is not that green anymore. It's it has a little bit of an orangey tint. But uh, we do have a shotgun. I'm gonna try and grapple over there. So uh, let's see. Ooh. Okay. So rocket propelled. So that means. Whoa. Whoa. Okay. Okay, so rocket propelled means it literally propels me with a rocket. Oh, 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 no, 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 no. Okay, I saved myself by grappling to the wall, but okay. Just go down, e eat some food. Okay, we got some, we got some zombies and I think I just broke my legs. It's gonna take a little bit of time to heal them, but I think it's time to get out of this place. Where are the zombies at? I wanna test out the shotgun first. Ah! Get away! Ooh, they don't die from one hit. That's interesting. Let's get this one. Oh, okay, this one died from only even four hits. That means these... Uh, oh! Re re reload it! Okay. That means these uh, these shotguns, they're very sensitive to uh, the distance that you shoot people from or the zombies from. If it's short distance, it's gonna be an easy, easy kill. Warden who? A list he of um, old newspaper picture of the arrest of Al Capone. What the? Really, is this a portrait of Al Capone? I don't think it is. Let me test, let me see. This is not Al Capone. This is some some lies. Non-contact visitation. Oh, we got a zombie. And who is he visiting? Who is he visiting? Can we visit him? Hello there, zombie. Hello there. Oh no, the wall is a little bit broken. No. Whew. No, no, no. I've got I've got the trigger finger ready, just in case. But let's go back to the submarine, because it, it is a little bit dangerous now. Let me just get back inside of the submarine. I want to show you guys something. I want to show you the progress of the base. We got a few more things we can place around the base. We got a smithing table, cutting board, and where's the smoker and cartography table? Where is it? Where is it? Oh no, did I lose it? I think I lost it. There's this thing, there is another thing, there is the machinery. Wait, it's called a machinery, not a smoker? What does it do, though? No, it's, it's a smoker, it's a smoker. <laughs> it literally cooks food, so I don't know what they mean. But uh, it's looking better, the base is looking way more cozier than it was before, so uh, we're definitely finding a lot of stuff. Oh, by the way, I'm gonna use... Uh, my diamond helmet, because it will give me more protection this way. Yeah, I'm way more protected. But let me see, we are already out in the ocean. Yep, nothing beside us, that's real nice. So we're gonna make our way to our next destination, 
and the next one is actually gonna be pretty cool because it's gonna be very different from the, from these ones because uh, I'm, I'm not gonna spoil it i'm not gonna spoil it but it's really cool i'm really hyped for it oh look at all the water going look at all the water going that is insane oh i see land okay so we are approaching oh that's a lot of land okay so we are approaching our final destination well it's, it's not really final destination we we got a lot more spots to visit but at the moment this is uh, this is our next stop we're gonna have to climb this mountain i'm gonna take out my boat place it let's go let's check it out by the way this is the submarine it's it's huge it's it's huge but uh i'm kind of used to it already I'm just scoping out the zombies. I don't see any zombies, so that's at least a little bit good, I guess. Let's go. We have to scale this mountain, go through the forest, and then we will see the hidden city. The hidden city. I I've never been there yet, and I think it's gonna be amazing when we get there. Hmm. Okay, we are near the mountain. We got we got a few zombies. There we go. Got rid of them. So we have to only scale this mountain and then we're gonna be we're gonna be there. Sounds easy enough. Whoa, hold up. Yo! I think the rocket propelled uh, grappler is actually better because it propels the rope even way further than before. And then we can use the rocket to literally go up so fast. Okay, there we go. We got a we got a road. We got a tunnel. I I probably should have used the tunnel to get over this mountain, but you know what? I think it'll be cooler if we scale it ourselves. We got zombies though, literally in the most random places. Never knew that you can find zombies here. So what are what are we looking at? Oh yeah, I see I see it. If you guys don't get it already. This is a big desert. As you can see, the bridge has been... Oh, the highway bridge has been broken off. We got zombies. I'm gonna... I'm gonna get rid of this guy because we are going down. But check this out. We got oil rigs over there just uh, doing something. I don't know what these things do. I always see them in video games and movies. But I, I don't know what they do, guys. If you got any idea, just leave them in the comments. I know it has something to do with oil. But I have no clue how they actually pump it out from the ground or something okay let's go we are <gasps> that's a lot of zombies i'm so thankful we didn't take the tunnel let's go let's go i'm gonna cross the cross oh okay never mind never mind let's go 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 by the desert i think there's gonna be a big problem oh i think there's gonna be a big zombie problem to be honest in, des in the desert because uh Maybe th this was the last city that fell, because it's a little bit away from all the other cities. And that means it was probably looked at as the last safe haven against the zombies. So we gotta be really careful around this place. Look at this. We gotta go. We, we got a floating flower. We have a floating flower over here. Can I pick it up? Is it gonna be good luck? Lily of the Valley. Yeah, it's definitely good luck. We got crazy structures over there in the distance. But I think I'm gonna... Ooh, okay, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go and... Uh, try to get to the next civilization point. Oh, no, I'm blinded. Yeah, the desert is pretty... Pretty dangerous. If you guys didn't notice it yet. Nothing a little morphine can't fix. And let me get my torch in my hand there. No, 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 no. There we go. Get it, get it, get it. Oh. Ooh, ooh. Okay. That was a little bit too close for comfort. Let me just heal up, guys. Let me heal up first. And then you, then you can come at me. Okay, we are entering the desert. And it's, it's a little bit more difficult than before. I think the, the motorway goes like this. It said the next exit is... It said the next exit is the one that will lead us to the city. But I don't know if that's if that's the exit. Is that it? L let me see. 
Okay, what is that? What is that? It's I, there's a road, but then it gets covered by sand. Okay. But is it our exit? Is it the exit we need to take? Yo, that's cars. And that's a truck, it's blocking the road. Oh, I see, okay. Okay. So the truck is blocking the road, and the cars couldn't leave the city. And the, and the road got swept away by the desert. So this is it. Yeah, that means, that means this is probably the way to the city, to be honest. So, uh... Let's go, let's see if we can make our way to the city that's hidden in the desert valley. I see a big sign. It says, uh, Lost Echoes. <laughs> Lost Echoes, huh? Okay, uh, can we, can we get to Lost Echoes? Just, uh, drop down. Okay, go, 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 run. Run, we got a ton of zombies. There is a ton of zombies in Lost Echoes, so we gotta be careful. But I'm just gonna follow the road. Okay, I just... I just got damaged a little bit. I think some of these bushes, they're, uh, they're like sharp. <gasps> oh, is that the city? Is that the city? I think it is. Yo, that's huge. Those are huge buildings. Let's go, let's go, let's go, we finally made it, we finally made it to the Lost City. And I know it was a long, a long trek from the submarine in the ocean to a city literally in the middle of a desert, but you know what guys, we did it, and I'm proud of us. I'm real proud, because I've never been here before. Look at this thing, what is that? That's a, that's a tower. I just gotta be also careful around the zombies, because I don't know about uh, this bio. Maybe the zombies here are, l are a little bit more deadly. From the looks of it, they're pretty normal. They move with your average speed and everything, but I don't know. Still, we gotta be careful, because we don't want to lose. We don't want to die. Hmm, I have an idea. I'm gonna, I'm gonna scale this crane. Can I, can I scale it? Oh, okay, I fell for some reason. Let me try it again. These grappling hooks, sometimes they work, sometimes they don't. As you can see, it don't. It doesn't work right now. Okay, can I scale the building? Oh, wow, that's high. Scale up, scale up. <gasps> this is a parking lot, okay. That means it doesn't have a lot of loot, to be honest. Okay, we are here. Let me see. Oh, we got zombies over there. All that falling broke my legs again, so... Gotta be careful. Go, oh, Gotta be careful with the zombies, with everyone. Let me see with the city. Whoa. Okay, this city has been definitely nuked. Let me see. Wow. Oh, no, 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 no. Get away, zombie. Get away. Get away. I don't want no zombies. L let me just inspect the city real quick. Okay. So it's literally just a mess. It's literally just a mess. The city was blown to bits. I see some crafting tables. I also hear some zombies. There we go. Get rid of the zombies. Drink some morphine. It'll fix me up r right away. Oh, there we go, and my leg is fixed. Morphine always saves the day. But check this out, guys. The city has been literally nuked. It's been nuked. It's insane. Let's see if we can find anything interesting, to be honest. Because right now, all I see are ruins and uh, a city that's been overtaken by the desert. So, uh, let's go... Let's scale down and see if we can find anything interesting. Looks like it's still daytime, so while it is day, we're gonna be uh, just scavenging the city a little bit more and uh, trying to find maybe some loot, but I do gotta be careful. Oh, what is that? Oh wow, that's a dead player, I think, or a dead body. 
Okay, yep. Yeah. Just as I was saying, there may be people in the city because it's a new addition to the map. It's gonna be really populated compared to the other places. And I'm expecting there will be even more zombie types. Oh, what was that? I just heard a shot. Yeah, that's that's what I was talking about. There are uh, definitely people in this city. But luckily, I do have a silenced rifle and that means I'm pretty much incognito. Oh yeah, I hear those shots. They're pretty close, but uh, all good. I hope. Let's uh, check out this place. Yep, that's another body. Oh, and we got a runner. Okay, so that was, I think, my first time meeting a zombie runner. I think this is another runner. So these are uh, special infected. They uh, have an attribute where they run way faster. Oh, oh no, what is that? That's a lot of barbed wire. I see some movement in the building. Probably a zombie. Okay, this is... this. Oh, whoa. Okay, this may be a player base. Uh, let's hope that they're not home. And we're just gonna be really incognito. We have a zombie over there. Uh, I hope he's not gonna come in. Okay, we got more even uh, props of dead bodies everywhere in the building. The zombie is blocked by the tank traps. That's good. Okay, I'm not gonna touch him. But can I jump over these? No, I cannot. Oh, we got a little zombie. He dropped a carrot. Let's go. We got... Oh, oh, we got a runner. We got another runner. And we got more zombies. Okay. Whoa, that's, that's a lot of zombies. That is a lot of zombies. I'm gonna have to use my shotgun because we are in close range. There are so many more special infected in this building or in this city it's pretty crazy but uh let's go let's just keep on moving oh i see a chest and a dead body beside the chest okay this doesn't look any different so let's let's check it out i think but first i'm gonna reload my gun okay just reloading it let's go oh that was a bomb oh no was that a trap is someone... Was that a player trap? I think that was a bomb chest. Oh no, everything is burning up. Everything is burning up. Where... I, I need to heal myself. Okay, there we go. We got some cooked pork chops. Oh no, we got more zombies coming in. We got more zombies coming in from the outside. I'm just using my revolver. I'm using anything I have on these guys. But they just keep on spawning. Oh, there is one behind me. Okay, I got him. Gonna get these guys as well from the back. Okay, I can't heal myself for some reason. I just drank some morphine. I, I already have the buff, but my health is not regenerating for some reason. I just got rid of more of these zombies. Let's go outside. Oh, was that a sniper shot? Oh, we got more zombies in the back. Okay. I think that was a sniper shot. I know it was real close. It was real close. Oh, more zombies. Oh, no, I'm getting shot at. I'm getting shot at. Go, 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 go. Run. I don't know where- Oh, I just heard- I just heard it again. Okay, uh, it came from that direction, I think. It came from this building or this one. Okay, uh, let's hope that the guy didn't see me run to my left. I'm gonna use my silenced M4 to get rid of these zombies that were behind me. The silenced weapon, as I said before, they will not hear- The bandits will not hear the silenced weapon, but I think that guy is using a AS-50 or a DMR because it is very loud. I'm just gonna try and track where the shots are coming from. Oh, that was so close. Okay, that was so close. He's literally in this building. I see his nameplate. I, I see his nameplate. Okay, that's it. We, we got him. I'm gonna be really careful. I'm gonna crouch. And I'm gonna get up on, on his floor. Go up, go up. Hopefully, he will not hear me. Uh, I think I broke my legs again. I'm gonna have to drink up some morphine. He is literally in this building. So, I just gotta be careful. Oh, he is literally in this building. He doesn't even know that I'm here. Oh, I think I found maybe his sniper nest. There's a lot of dead bodies. And I think zombies are literally coming to him. I don't have any melee weapons. Let's hope that this silenced weapon will be enough. Okay, I, I see his nameplate. It's literally still there. He didn't move. That's good. I'm, I'm just following the, the dead bodies on the floor. I think there is one over here as well. 
Yep, that's right. We also have so so much barbed wire. This is insane. I'm just following the dead bodies. Oh, I see a lot of barbed wire and two double doors. He may be in that room. Okay, I'm just crouching. I'm literally crouching. Oh, a zombie just spawned in. Oh my god, these zombies are spawning in and running, but they're dying at the barbed wire. Okay, I'm, I'm just trying to be crouching still. Oh, I hope that he didn't hear me, because I, I just uh, cut myself on, the, on some barbed wire accidentally. Okay, I think we are good. I think he's behind this door, literally. We just got more zombies. I'm gonna destroy this barbed wire, just in case. Okay, he's literally behind this door, but uh, he, he doesn't know that I'm here. Oh no. Oh no, I, I think he heard me. I just shot. Hello? Hello? Oh no, he's he's trying to speak to me. Hello? He hello? Are you friendly? Yo, I can hear you. I can hear you. Um, I'm friendly, yeah. Oh, you're um, friendly? You, you want to team up or you're alone? Guys, he's asking me if I'm alone and if I want to team up. He, he literally... Okay, okay. Um, yeah, no, no, I'm not alone. I'm not alone. I have a team. Uh, are you friendly? Uh, yeah, I'm friendly. I'm, I'm a solo player. I'm just, I'm just chilling. Okay, okay. Oh, okay. Um, so if I come in, will you shoot you? me? Where are you? I'm just outside your door, but I am friendly. Guys, I'm pretty much pinned down. Um, yeah, was that yeah, just yeah, you I, shooting? I, I, was that you shooting? No. Oh, I, I accidentally, I, I accidentally shot. Okay. Um, um you can... Uh, are you geared? What gear do you have? Guys, he's asking me if I am geared. That is definitely not a friendly a player. Do you have a gun? I'm, I'm... Hey, what up? I'm just gonna walk into your room, because I'm getting squished by zombies here. Just don't shoot me, okay? I am friendly. Um, do you have a gun? Yes, I do have a gun, but I, I will not shoot. Mm, no, no, you can't. Um, oh, I I, you. Dude, I'm getting squished by zombies. Can you please let me in? I'm on pretty okay. low health. Okay. okay, you can come in, but... Don't have your weapon out. Okay, okay. Guys, he said I, I can come in. And uh, uh, my clan pretty much dominates the server, so don't. Okay, guys, don't, he's, he don't said that uh, he's friendly and I should come in, but with no weapon yeah, in hand. I'm gonna do in. that, but I, I'm just gonna have it on quick draw just in case. I'm gonna take my shotgun out. I just cleared out the zombies. Okay, I'm, uh, he literally does not sound friendly. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna charge in with the shotgun. As I heard, he has a he has a sniper rifle oh, yeah, and wow. okay, he's trying to speak to me. He's still asking me questions if I'm alone. Um, okay, he is not friendly. I'm I'm gonna are you, are you, I'm gonna are you open alone? the door and I'm gonna shoot him. He doesn't know that I have a shotgun. I literally have an advantage over him. Let's go, are guys. Yeah, I'm, I'm here. I'm, I'm here, dude. I'm just gonna open the door and I'm gonna no, walk in. No, okay. No, 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 you can't. Okay, guys, you. he, I, I'm, I'm, I'm rushing in. Don't come in. Oh, oh, he's shooting, he's shooting. Okay, Don't come in. He's shooting me. I'm, I'm. Oh, there we go. I got him. I got him. Ooh. Oh, damn! The shotgun is OP in the, in the how, in the buildings. Whoa! Look at all the loot. This guy was stacked. It's a sniper nest. He's literally in a sniper nest. Whoa, that's a lot of loot. Okay, let me see. He has some scopes, suppressors, netherite leggings. Yes, sir. Okay. Is that an AK? We got an AK. We got golden apples. Ooh, what the? Is that a cruiser MK1? Is that is that a tank? I'm not sure if that's a tank or not. But we do have a lot of weapons, a lot of ammo. He even has a flashlight. It seems like he is literally ready. We also have a villager head. What is, what is that? What is a villager head? Oh, whoa. So, oh, these are the decorations he uh, was uh, putting up on uh, in, in that trap over there. Okay, I see. It is also nighttime. He had a sniper. That's what he probably used to shoot me. He also had a revolver. 
Okay, I'm gonna pick up the revolver. Oh wait, I have a revolver already, so never mind. Whispers to you, friendly, you stupid. Oh, look at that! Look at the look in the ch in the game chat, guys. He's literally DMing me that he was friendly. I mean, he he literally shot at me. You're a dumbass. What? I'm not a dumbass. He literally shot me first. You guys saw that, right? He was literally not friendly. He was so dodgy. It was insane. I'm gonna get the chest plate, the nether right helmet as well. The whole server will, will be against you now. Oh, okay. So he's telling me that the whole server will be against me. Yep, sure. They always say that. I'm also gonna silence my rifle, put a scope on it as well. Oh, let's go. That's a, that's a new gun. Oh, what is that? That's a backpack on the floor? And it's empty. Never mind. It's uh, pretty empty. We got spirit orbs. We got pants. I think, I think that's it. We looted up pretty much everything. Oh, oh, let's go. We got, a, we got another tank, I think. Or is that two tanks? This guy was probably in a large clan, because he was stacked. You know what? I think I have to leave this place ASAP. I just cleared this guy out, he's probably gonna be so mad, and he's literally telling his whole clan about me. So, uh, yeah guys, let's let's go. Uh, we, we need to dip. We need to go. Do you want to give me back my loot? Uh... I'm not gonna- I'm not gonna say anything. If he wants to, he can literally come back to this place. And I just left like a revolver and a few- a few, uh, weapons still. So he literally can get it if he wants to. But we, we gotta go. We gotta go. We gotta hide. Uh, since it's night time, we have to sleep over the night. Because at night it's pretty dangerous. There- there is way more zombies. It's a brand new day. And we are running in the city. Oh, what is this? Is this a metro? Los Echoes Metro Station. Oh, let's check it out. I hear you are at Station D. Okay, I hear zombies. But uh, let's hope that they're not gonna be nearby. Whoa, this thing goes down deep. Okay, we got zombies. Oh, we got a lot of zombies. Okay, I mean, metro stations are pretty packed. Oh, well, we got runners from every direction. You know what? Never mind. Never mind. I don't want to go into the metro. I'm gonna get these fast zombies down. Okay. There we go. Let's let's go back to the surface. I, I don't want to <laughs> explore no metro with so many zombies. The plan for today is just to scavenge the best loot possible in the city, so I could. Uh, oh, oh, that's a player. I I don't know. He, oh, oh, he sees me. Okay, he he shot me. Okay, never mind. Never mind. Go into the building. Oh no, I think my screen is a little bit wonky. We got we got some zombies here. That's a big runner. Okay. I'm gonna I'm gonna try and get a shot out at this guy. Because I know where he is. I'm gonna work fast so he would not have any time to change his location. I'm just gonna I'm gonna grapple. I'm gonna grapple to the top of the building. Go, go, go. If he has a grappling hook and he took higher ground as well, that's gonna be that's gonna be trouble. But I'm pretty sure I'm working fast. Where is he? I don't see him. Oh, I, I see I see his nameplate. Oh, he's killing zombies. Okay, he's literally following me. Uh Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna shoot him. Let's hope Oh, there we go. Let's let's I, I was saying let's hope that it's a one shot, but but it is. Let's go, we got him. He did he drop any loot? No, he didn't. Okay, never mind. Let's go, we got the zombie. He was, I think, wearing leather armor, so his loot was probably not that good even. Let's uh, let's just get out of this place. Maybe it's literally the same guy with the clan. The other dude was rolling with, and if that's if that's the case, that's gonna be that's gonna be pretty bad. We just gotta run. Let's uh, run away from this place because we just made a lot of sound with the firefight. I've been running for such a long time. I'm just trying to find anything good in the city, but it's just ruins. It's literally just all ruins, guys. That means uh, I should probably head back to my submarine. Oh, oh, okay, it's a flower. I thought I was uh, getting shot at, never mind. Oh, okay, we just heard some shots. I, I, I don't know where they came from. 
I don't know where they came from. I'm gonna use my silenced rifle to get rid of this little zombie. I don't know if those shots were aimed at me, but uh, is there someone on the roof? No. Okay, never mind. I don't know where the person shooting is at, but uh, I'm just trying to scope out maybe a nameplate, hopefully. I'm gonna take some higher ground on a rooftop. Okay, I'm, I think I'm running away from his shots. That's not good. I, I really want to check out and probably find them. Oh, he was slain by zombies. Okay, that means uh, the, the death screens are in proximity, guys. And that means uh, if someone dies nearby, then it only tells me that uh, someone was killed by zombies or a player. Th that means this guy was literally really close. But since I can't see his name tag, it's going to be pretty much impossible to find them. I'm gonna check out some of this loot. We got, we got pretty, pretty much nothing over here. We have lift your energy levels up. Please uh, use with caution. Is this an energy drink? Let me see. What is this? Is this an energy drink, really? Boom. Oh, whoa! It gave me absorption speed, even two hearts. Oh, I just heard another shot. I don't know where it was from. I'm just crouching to hide my nameplate. Okay, I'm gonna get on the rooftop and try and see if I can find that guy. It sounds like it's pretty close. So, I don't know. I don't know. Maybe the guy will be friendly. Oh, is that a... Yeah, yeah, it is. Okay, I found him. I found him. Let's go. He's in this building, maybe? Damn, there's so many players in this, in this city that it's pretty crazy. I'm gonna drink some morphine while I can. I'm gonna turn off my flashlight. I don't know if he's in this building, but there is an opening in the ceiling. Let's just hope that, uh, he's... Uh, I don't know, maybe... He, no, no, he's not in this room. Okay, he's not in this room. He's in the floor below me. I think I hear him literally breaking blocks. Let's, uh, let's see if we can... I don't, oh, oh, those shots are so loud. Let's see if we can get a sneak attack on him. Let's hope he did not hear me opening this door. Okay, this is a dead end. I'm gonna have to use my grappling hook and find another way in. Okay, where is he? Where is he? Oh, there he is. There he is. I see him. He's running into that building over there. Okay, that's good. I'm gonna try and follow him and I don't know if he's a bandit or if maybe he's a friendly player. But he may be a clansman. He doesn't see me. I, I can take a shot at any moment, but you know what? I don't know. I don't know if he's friendly. Uh, if he's part of their clan, then that's that's going to be uh, bad if I uh, leave him alone. But if he's... Okay, I'm going to use the grappling hook to get to the next building. But if he's literally a friendly player, I just don't want to shoot him because I'm just not that guy. Let's go. I'm going to scale this building as well. I'm gonna go inside of this building. I really hope he did not hear my shot. I didn't think about shooting just now. Oh, that, I think that's another player. Is, is that is that still him or is that another player? Oh, well, okay. So I think the, the other guy went that way maybe. But there is then this guy. Okay, let's, let's go, let's go. I'm gonna try and get him. I'm pretty sure when uh, the first guy I killed said that the whole server will be after me. I think these guys are literally hunting me. Oh, there he is. Okay, I'm gonna get him with a sniper. There we go. I got him. I got him. Okay, that's good. And we got a zombie behind us. You know what, guys? There's too many players literally in this city. I'm running. I am running uh, back to the submarine. It will take a little bit of time. Let's, uh, let's go. I'm gonna drink another piece of morphine. I know it is nighttime and there is a lot of zombies and a lot of bandits as you can see out and about. But you know what? We need to run back to the submarine. This city is literally too dangerous. I thought since it's a new city, it will literally have the best loot. But as far as I'm seeing guys, there's only bandits that hunt players. Literal clans with snipers. And uh, everything is just ruined. Canadian Anubis. Okay, there is some guy, he's asking me if I'm Canadian or something. 
No, I am not. So I, I don't know why he's asking that. Ça va français? Oh no, he's asking me if I speak French or if I am French, guys. I I, I don't know. I don't know this. I don't know what to say. You know what? I'm just I'm just running. If he's literally trying to speak French with me, that means he was probably not part of the clan. So that means I feel pretty bad that he uh, that that I killed him. So you know what? I'm gonna try and probably whisper him back. I'm gonna reply to him. I'd tell him that I didn't take any of his loot. But first I'm gonna get up on a little safe space. This piece of wood so the zombies would not be able to get me. Okay, let's... Uh, okay, there we go. I just whispered, hey, your loot is where you died. I didn't take any. I hope that uh, he will understand me. Because I, I don't know, he literally speaks French, probably. I, I just told him that I, I didn't take his loot because I'm, I'm a nice guy. Let's just run back to the submarine. This city is literally like a battlegrounds. There are so many players. It's pr it's pretty much insane. It is daytime. And I also found that the first guy that I killed, he had this AK-104 and a ton of magazines for it. And it's literally really pimped out, guys. It's, it has a cool scope that doesn't zoom in as much as an ACOG scope. So uh, this one and it also has a silencer and because it uses heavy bullets i think it literally uh means it's uh you know a little bit stronger than the normal weapons we got zombies coming in from every direction but we are managing we are surviving we are still in the desert by the way and i'm walking really slowly i know it's a little bit dangerous to walk so openly in the road, I should probably go down and walk through the fields, but since I am pretty much on low health, I uh, I can really uh, accidentally walk into one of those uh, black flowers or some sharp objects that are... Th there's for some reason a ton of them in the desert, and that will literally be uh, GG, unfor unfortunately. So I I'm just uh, playing really carefully. I'm also gonna eat a little bit. There's some zombies and some barbed wire and a few bodies on the ground. Okay, maybe there is some good loot in this area since there is, a, I don't know, some survivor. Oh, yep, some survivor remnants. Let's check out this thing. Usually there is loot in the trunks of the cars. We got bows and that's pretty much it. Anything in the front? Nope. Okay, never mind. By the way, who is this? This is like a military guy, but he's a, he's he's pretty pretty much dead. Okay, let's go back to the submarine. I never expected the desert to be so hostile. It's literally insane how hostile it is. There's clan wars in the cities. That's literally so different from my game with a submarine. <gasps> Whoa, that guy was. I, I think that zombie was a uh, pretty fast. It was a runner. Let's check out this vehicle. Please be something good. We got a store-bought beetroot. Beetroot. Let's eat it up. And it literally gave us, I think, zero hunger bars. Yo, what is this? This is like a construction area thing. That's crazy. There is also so many roads just bombarded, as you can see, and uh, it's it pretty pretty much tells that the government was fighting against the zombies at first by nuking all these heavily populated cities, but then they just kind of gave up, and that's uh, that's pretty sad. But you know what? I I, I can't say uh, I can't say nothing. You gotta fight zombies with with how you can fight them. It also says in the chat that it's cooling off a little bit because the sun is setting down it's i think it's about 2 p.m right now 2 p.m so uh we gotta be heading pretty much back to the submarine because if we don't make it back there in time we may get fr frozen to death in the desert the deserts they get really cold when it's nighttime and really hot when it's daytime what is that that's a zombie on a chicken <laughs> okay climb up Okay, we are nearing the tunnels. I hope these will lead me back to my submarine. I, uh, I, oh yeah, yeah, this building, yep, it's definitely the way we came in 
through the desert, so this is literally the same road. But we're gonna go through the tunnel now, because I think it'll be a little bit easier. Oh, oh come on. I, I can't use the grappling hook. Please, let me just get up. Just get up. Boom. There we go. We are up. Let me get my uh, flashlight in hand, because we are entering the tunnel. We got some runners, and they sound really, really bad. Oh, no. These guys, they're literally fast. Those guys are so fast, some of them. Let's go, go, go. Let's hope that uh, I can get to the submarine in safety, but we are getting pretty close, so that's good. I'm gonna get rid of these uh, fast zombies, just in case. Oh, 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 oh no, that was a charger, that was a charger zombie. Oh no, where, where, where are they coming from? I got one. I got one. Okay, I think... Am, am I stuck? I was stuck to your wall or something? The, if you guys saw the screen, my screen was muddy for a little bit. That's because uh, there is a variant of zombies called Chargers. And uh, what they do is they charge you and make you slow down. Uh, you get a slowness weak, weak debuff. So let's just... Uh, oh, be careful. Okay, yep, yeah, that was another Charger. There is so many chargers for some reason, and I cannot move. When I'm charged, I get a debuff, and I cannot move. Let's go, go, go. Since it's nighttime, there's so many zombies. You know what? I should probably spend the night in this, this little bus. I think that would be for the best, to be honest, because... Uh, as you can see, guys, I'm getting just swarmed by zombies. There's too many of them when it's, uh, when it's nighttime, and the special infect that come out and that's not good this rv looks pretty cozy to be honest so i guess i'll uh, get my backpack out and place it on the oh no no not on the not not on the ground i need to break these blocks there we go there we go open up the bed can i open it oh no please open the bed Scan, deploy the sleeping bag, check the surrounding area. What does that mean? I'm pretty sure this is pretty clear. Let me just put out a few torches. There we go. Okay, can I deploy the bed? No, I cannot. If I pick it up and... Place it down away from the door, will it work now? No, it doesn't. Okay, I don't, I don't know. I don't know, guys. It seems I'm AFKing. But, whew, I thought that was a player. That zombie looked so different from other zombies. And he's missing an eye. Wonderful. <laughs> well, oh, there's a chest here. We got bones, gray jackets, books. Okay, I'm gonna take the torch. I, uh, I'll see you guys when it's daytime, and I am probably a little bit closer to the... To the, <laughs> to the submarine, so yeah, I'll spend the night here, just wait over the big zombie hordes. I'll see you guys when it's daytime. Ah, okay, it's still here. It's still here, the good old submarine, but it's pretty far away, so I will, uh, I will get some trees. There we go, that should be enough, let's go, uh... Let's go craft a boat and get back on the submarine where it's nice and safe. I missed my bed so much, my comfortable bed and everything like that. I missed it. I, I don't want to PvP in, in that desert city again. Get the crafting table, place it, get the boat. Like so. Okay, there we go. I don't want to PvP. I don't want to... Uh, fight other players in that city again. Oh, that's our boat. That's our boat. Oh, wow So it literally stayed here. I thought since uh, a few days have passed that uh, it wasn't here anymore, but it's here That's so nice Okay, I mean my submarine is here. So uh, I guess it's pretty much expected that it's still here but let's get back to the submarine and When we, we get back there, I want to I, I really want to pimp out my base a little bit we got some city over there in the distance, but uh, we're not gonna check it out because we need to go. We need to go. Where is my grappling hook? There it is. 
Grapple up. Jump up. Oh, jump up. There we go. Jump up. Beautiful. Go inside. Oh, my perfect base. I miss you so much and it hasn't been raided. Okay, we are in the ocean already. I don't see anything nearby, so that's that's good. That's good at, at least. That means we're moving to your next destination. But I, I, I crafted some razor wire. I really want to uh, protect my base a little bit better. And as you can see, we are pretty much in the middle of the ocean. That means uh, the submarine, it, it can go underwater. So it's pointless to make any base defenses outside of it. So I will make them inside on the razor wire. It will do just that. I will make a little maze that will help, hopefully, protect me against zombies. And also players. Oh, because it's really effective against players. Zombies get uh, get damaged from this thing and it takes like only three ticks for, for them literally to uh, drop because of the barbed wire, so I guess that's gonna be a really good zombie defense. I think that's literally better. Ah, I probably should get some outside just in case. You know what? Yeah, I probably should. I'm gonna place some like this. Just leave a little bit open for me to literally climb up all the time. There we go. And see right here, there we go. I mean, I'm, I'm just randomly placing it down. I, I know. But hopefully it'll it'll save my life at some point. If some bandit ju just decides to crawl up outside my uh, submarine while I'm uh, sleeping, and he's just crawling up, and he doesn't see any th this barbed wire because it's nighttime, and he just walks into it. Hopefully, uh, if that happens in a one in a millionth chance, I will hear it, and it will save my life. <laughs> and it will save my life. Yes, it will. Boom, boom. Get the door and get the lever. Perfect. Perfect. So now my base is literally even more protected. And I know, guys, I know. It's a submarine. It's already protected pretty much fully. But you know what? If somebody decides to raid the submarine, because uh, submarines, they usually have good loot. They usually have good loot. We're still in the ocean, so we still haven't reached our next objective. But submarines have good loot, and if a clan literally decides to attack my submarine, they will be met with uh, with even base defenses inside inside of the actual submarine before they get to the actual little base that I have right here. Let's get the shotgun, the sniper rifle, the magnum. I don't need this rifle anymore, or no, I I need the AK. Uh what a, oh i got two snipers which one has the better scope oh yeah this one okay so i don't need this sniper okay what is this is this a glock is this a glock i, I didn't notice that i have a glock oh whoa it's literally, literally semi-automatic i think that's an upgrade from the revolver oh yes let's go we got a we got a glock okay we are pretty much ready geared up for our, our next objective we have arrived to our next destination as you can see it's a swamp <laughs> yep it is a swamp so let's get the boat out and uh, i just hope that we're gonna find some good loot i've never been in a swamp before uh, like this so i guess uh, i don't know if we're gonna find any players I have experience in the cities, in the deserts, in the mountains with players, and in the zombie apocalypse, how many players are in that region, specific region. But I've, I've never been in a swamp, I, and I don't know if I ever thought that, hey, a zombie apocalypse just hit, let's go to your swamp. So it'll be a little bit interesting, but I just want to look at the submarine real quick. It's cool. It looks really cool. I parked it up, as you can see, pretty nicely. It's real nice. Let's just hope I didn't make a lot of noise and it didn't startle the natives of the swamp. Like that zombie guy over there. You know what? I'm gonna test out my Glock. Because it's a, it's a new one. And it takes about three shots, but I think it fires more than three bullets at a time. But uh, it takes three shots from a distance of about 10 meters, I'd say, so that's good to know. 
And one more good thing about a swamp is it's literally all in the water or at least a little bit in the water and we can just use the boat and we don't have any problems of running into big zombie hordes or being slow because the boat is a little bit faster. Whoa, these trees are big. They can get pretty big. Oh, I got an achievement. Mother's Nature's Beauty. 100 achievement points have been reached. Yes, let's go. That's cool. Oh, oh, we got a zombie. I think this one is a charger because he got those little status effects around him. That means when he gets close, he will charge me. So I will not allow him to do that. And I will also get rid of these zombies. Okay, let's go. Uh, let's check out this tree. Maybe there is something on the top because I did get an achievement of um, nature's beauty, I guess. That means there's got to be something good here, right? Let me use my uh, grappling hook to climb up. Oh, okay. Got to be careful not to fall. While I'm at it, I'm also going to scope out, scope out that zombie. There we go. Nice. That, that's real nice. If I also get the length of the rope a little bit longer, I can use the rocket in my grappling hook to... Uh, maneuver myself a little bit faster oh it didn't work it didn't work okay never mind I, I'm, I'm pretty much a noob with grappling hooks i guess oh okay let's go go back up seems we're not using grappling hooks it's a little bit difficult a little bit difficult oh two zombies on on the tree itself that's interesting but we gotta be careful. I'm just looking out for any player built, uh, I don't know, buildings, I guess. I, things, items. Just keeping a lookout. What is that? That's that's pink wool. Do you guys think that's like just berries? Yeah, it, it seems that it's a part of the tree. It's not a player structure. But I'm just trying to see if I can find any, any players that decided to live in a swamp by climbing these trees, which are pretty tall. They're pretty tall. I think we're gonna have to use a grappling hook to get to the very top. So let's go. Climb up, climb up, climb up, climb up. Oh, whoa, we got to the very, very top. That's cool. And I even went around, like, somehow in a weird way down the rope. Oh, wow, we are pretty high. Gotta be careful not to fall, to be honest, because uh, uh, a fall from this height would probably be pretty deadly I want to go there to that side oh okay just don't play like me guys if, if you're playing uh, zombie mod pack yourself play it a little bit more safer not not like me L look at this I, I can't even stand I can't even stand straight okay I, now I'm dizzy now I am literally dizzy because I uh, I fell so many times Go up. I'm gonna drink some morphine. It's a little bit dizzy. And where's my uh, where's my flashlight? There it is. Okay, it should be easier now. Look at this sunset, guys. That's so nice. And you know what? Building a base in a tree like this would be so cool, because it's huge. It's literally so huge. And I don't think there's a lot of players in the swamp, to be honest. So that's even a plus, even a literal plus. I'm gonna eat a golden apple just in case to heal myself up a little bit. And since it is nighttime, I guess I will sleep at the top of this tree because I think it's gonna be safer at the top of the tree than at the bottom in the water because of the zombies and stuff like that. So uh, yeah, I'll see you guys when it's daytime and Hopefully, I'll find something interesting in the swamp. The zombies are still trying trying to get me. Or, wait, is he, is he eating the tree? Is he eating the tree? He looks like it. Let me get down on this block. Hey, dude. I don't think he sees me still. It looks like he's literally eating the tree. Oh, now he stopped. He's a little bit mad. The, why am I shining a flashlight at him? He's probably thinking that... I'm gonna get rid of this guy. Ooh, that was a one shot. That's real nice. Okay, it's uh, I think it's clear. So yeah, I'll uh, 
I'll sleep AFK a little bit. I'll see you guys when it's daytime and hopefully I'll find something interesting. So we could check out if there's anyone here. That's that zombie over there. It has no arms. Let's uh, quickly get rid of it. Okay, we are safe. There's more zombies in the distance, but I'm not going to get them. I see a lot of chests. I, I see a lot of chests. We got old cannonballs. The steel looks rusted and brittle. An old cannonball. Okay. <laughs> okay. Oh, we got a we got a big map. We got a chair. Okay. And we also have a chest with some arrows. Oh. Uh, ancient blunderbuss. I don't know what that means. But there was just another zombie that attacked me. I see more chests at the bottom, but let's uh, quickly just finish off Flameheart's Cutlass and a Skull Collector. Finish a low health enemy with this sword to claim your trophy. What the? So what, uh, I should get a zombie? Defeat a zombie with this thing and I'll get a trophy? I mean, I, I definitely want to see what what's the trophy. There is a ton of zombies coming in from this direction. So let's... Uh, Let's try and see if we can defeat a zombie. <gasps> what did I get? I picked up something, I think. Zombie head. Hold up. Hold up. We can place this thing. I've seen the I've seen these already. <gasps> it's is it big? Oh no, it's n normal size? No, it's a little bit big. What the I don't even know. Okay, let's see. Can I defeat uh, more zombies? I'll get even more of these trophies. It seems that we, we're literally using this skull collector. We're literally snatching the skull and the spine out of the out of out of the zombie bodies. It's pretty wild, to be honest. I'm gonna collect three, and I think that'll be enough. I wonder if they work also as a way to scare off the zombies. I'm gonna get the rest of these guys with my uh, silenced AK just in case, so they wouldn't make too much sound and attract any more zombies. Let's go back to the boat and see if we can find anything else that's worth of looting. So we just checked this chest. Yes, we did. That's another zombie, but we got him. Let me get my flashlight out. Okay. Oh. Oh. Okay. There is someone on a bed and it doesn't look like they're alive. It seems that they've been covered up by something. Okay, so someone died, probably. That's not good. Let's check out these chests. Oh, let's go. We got so many carrots. We will not be starving anymore, it seems. That's good. Even more arrows. Even more arrows. A compass. Uh, I don't know, a pocket watch. Oh, we got a turret. Hey, let's go. Oh, we got two turrets. Shoots arrows quickly at mobs. We got sweet swords. That's nice. And we also have a notable merchant spyglass. I'm gonna trade my normal spyglass for a notable merchant spyglass. I think that'll be a little bit fancier. Wow, we got so many arrows and we also got swords. Even more spyglasses. Crate of Devil's Plants, Ashen Wind's Skull. Ah, I don't know what all this means. But I don't know. Oh, we got a we got a red sleeping bag. I know I know what this is. I'm gonna take this. <gasps> oh, oh no, that was a trap chest. Please, please, I really hope that th there are no bandits and this is not another bandit trap. Let's go. I'm gonna get this a great way. Okay, we got some alcohol in this thing. You know what? Go, go, go. It's getting night time, and uh, I I don't know if that chest was another bandit trap to uh, you know. Get a normal player trapped and explode them. Let's hope that there's no sniper shots that are gonna be fired at me at the moment. I'm just quickly trying to run away as fast as I can. I think we're good. I think we are good. Last time, a, uh, I stumbled upon a chest that was boogie, boogie rigged with a bomb. I got shot at by a sniper from a sniper's nest, so that's not good. We gotta be more careful with the with those chests. But I really don't know how to, uh, you know, guys, uh, differentiate them from normal chests. I don't know what's the difference. It's also getting pretty late. I think I'll uh, probably climb a tree and sleep over the night, I guess. Let's uh, try and sleep over here. 
Let's climb up this tree. Oh, this one is really high. I, I like this one. Where is my grappling hook? There it is. Shoot, go up. Go up. Okay, and the... Uh, like this. Like, oh, no, no, no. Please go up. Go up, go up. No, I don't want these zombies. Okay, I'm gonna get rid of these zombies first. Just in case. There we go. There we go. Now he's definitely dead. That zombie just got a... S oh, oh, that's a... Uh, that's a that's, uh, building. I'm gonna turn off my flashlight. Hopefully, uh, they didn't hear my sniper shot just now. But I see a building in a swamp. And there is a single torch on the second floor. I can see through the window, but I don't see any movement. I'm gonna get out my spyglass. There is that torch over there. But I don't see any movement in the windows. Okay. Okay, We I, I don't know what to think about this, but you know what? I'm gonna see you guys when it's daytime. We're gonna check out that building. And see if there is anybody inside. I'm gonna reload my uh, my AK. It is daytime. I, st oh, I see a player. Okay, yep. Huh. Should do oh he's building I think reinforcements on his base. You know what guys? I'm gonna roll up behind him. Since this is not the PvP hotspot area that is uh, the very populated city. Uh I think this guy may be friendly or he may be, I don't know, a little bit more casual. Because he's not in the hotspot area with uh, people that are all bandits. He's literally in a swamp. That means he's literally alone and probably probably friendly. Probably friendly. Okay, where is he at? He's... He's... Oh, he got a lot of barbed wire around the house. I think he's trying to build this place off. And I also don't see him anymore. I'm gonna try and get a little bit closer. There's some zombies on the second floor, or I mean the third floor. So, yeah, gotta be careful, gotta be careful. Okay, I'm nearing... Oh, okay, he uh, he definitely has a gun. He's shooting these zombies. Oh, he does he see me? He he doesn't see me. Are you serious? Okay, that's that's easy. Oh, yo yo yo, friendly, friendly, friendly. Are you friendly? I'm friendly. I'm friendly. No one's doing. Okay. Hey, what up, dude? Are, are you you playing alone? Bro, oh, please. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I'm not gonna shoot you. You sound like a friendly guy. Are you playing alone? Yeah. Damn, that's a that's a good house you got here. Uh, how long have you been living in the swamp? Since the server restart, it was about seven days ago. Oh, so oh, damn! Your your turrets are acting up. They're shooting you. Yeah, yeah, they will shoot you. Don't come close. Oh, I see. They're made to attack everyone, even the zombies, huh? I'm just gonna shoot the zombie. Yeah. Damn, dude, you're literally the first person I met that's friendly and isn't shooting me on sight. No, no, me and my boys, we don't really shoot on sight. Oh, that's so nice. Okay, that's that's cool. Is is this your base? Because uh, these turrets, how do you get inside your base? If the turrets are covering the main entrance. Well, they primarily shoot, you know, on friendlies. But, um, how do I say it? Sometimes I just go through the window and it's the boys that set up the turrets, so I just go around them. Oh, okay, so you, you're playing with your buds. That's cool, that's cool. I mean, hey, uh, yeah. don't worry, dude, I'm not, I'm not shooting you. Do you want to trade some gear? I have so many guns, I don't even know what to do with them. Yeah, of course, of course. What do you offer me? I mean, let's let's go inside. Let's go inside because I don't feel really uh, really safe around this area. If if I met you, I, I you know that I found a pirate ship with literally a dead corpse inside of it, right? Just yesterday. Mm, never seen that before. No. Damn. Okay. Well, it's it's pretty close to your base, but I don't know. I don't know. Is this your base? Uh, it's just a toilet. You want to go inside my base? Yeah. You can go on the toilet. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, how long have you been playing on a server? Uh, just a few days, a few days. I'm, I'm not gonna tell him guys that I'm playing for, that's, uh, that's cool. for a challenge, because if he literally finds out that I'm playing for like a 100 days video challenge, he, cool? may, uh, he may 
game at me just to, I don't know, grief me. You never know with these players. I, I, I still don't know what his is. card, sir. Yeah, what up, dude? Uh, show me something. Oh, whoa, what is that? That's a head on a spike. It's probably too bored of zombies. You never know these days. Uh, that's, that's cool, that's cool. Yeah, I don't know if those things work. So where is your base? Is this literally it? Yeah, this is my base. Um, it was uh, already a pre-established building, but I just kind of took it over with me and with the boys and we built off wires and turrets. Oh, where, the where are the stuff. boys? Where are the boys you're speaking of? Oh, oh. Guys, I don't, I don't know they're what offline. I'm about that. Oh, they're... Oh, they're offline, huh? Oh, okay, okay. I mean, if, uh, yeah. if you're friendly, that's cool. That's cool with me. It's getting a little bit late. Are, are you shooting zombies? Yeah, yeah. Where did you go? Oh, there's a charger. Careful. I got him. Yeah, cool. Um, well, this is primarily my base, and um, we got some loot here, some chests. Oh, I would that's nice. If you want to look into the chests, oh, that's a lot of chests. Like, we don't have protection yet on the base. Oh, okay. We're just friends playing together, but we will at some point get the VIP status, the member status, and. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah I, I get time. it. I get it. I got the flashlight. Do you not have a flashlight? I do have a flashlight, but I don't need it. Oh, okay, okay. Oh, dude, I, I've, I've, I saw this lantern last night. I thought that no way there's someone in the base. And this is literally the only lantern in the house. I literally saw it from a good distance away. And I'm not gonna lie. You yep. caught me off guard because I was just about to quit the server. Because I've been playing for 12 hours straight. And what? Even Are yeah, you serious? 12 hours. We built all of this just today. Whoa. Okay. I mean, I don't see anything built here. I, I think this is yeah. a. I think this I house was uh, generated. Base. Yeah, we just found the base and we took it over. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah, I get it. I get it. My friend, he's been playing for a very long time here and he's like a professional. Oh, there's a, another floor. Oh, is this literally your base where you sleep? Uh, just, just, yeah. Yeah, that's it. Damn, uh, that's we, that's not really we pretty. Sleep. That's we don't not pretty. Sleep. We just run around and loot. When it's nighttime, then that's the time when we hit the town and just loot up. Oh, okay. We've met a few bandits. Did you encounter any bandits before? Oh yeah, dude. Uh, in the there are so many bandits all the time in the city. You really gotta be careful around the cities. Hold up, hold up. Don't quit the server. Do you do you want to trade some loot? I can literally give you some good stuff, and I you mean, can continue I would playing. It if you wouldn't, when I quit the game, if you wouldn't raided the base because of my friends only logging in maybe oh like no no hours. you're good you're good do you know how i got to this swamp no no uh did you get a boat here uh, no i took a submarine <laughs> yeah, you took a submarine yes i did y i can show you if you want to tomorrow i think it's nighttime already yeah it's nighttime do you dude can i sleep over in this base with you and we can check out the submarine tomorrow Mm, yeah, of course. I mean, we can just wait out for the sun to come up and then we can check out the base. Or are you talking about IRL days? Because, uh, yeah, I, I can definitely show you around. You can meet my friends. Uh, you can join us if you want to. We're like a friendly bunch. Oh, that's that's cool. I mean, I'm not, I'm not really looking to join a faction, to be honest, or a clan. Oh, floor two. What do we have here? It's just, uh, just base building. Oh, okay, I, I get it, I get it. I mean, I'm we not looking to join a clan, but I, I'm literally definitely friendly. And uh, seems yeah, like a good that. place, to be honest. But I, I see that you guys need a little bit more, uh, a little bit more, <laughs> you know. Have you got a weapon? Renovation weapon in the building. Uh, have you I got any weapons? Hook? Oh, no, I, I have a grappling hook already. I have a grappling hook oh, already. Oh, your grappling hook is uh, powered by uh, a thruster. I have just a regular one. Oh, oh, oh careful, zombie. Okay, good, good. Damn, that's a, that's a cool Uzi. Or, is, no, is that a Uzi or a rifle? It is. It's Whoa! A level sniper. Oh, damn. Dude, do you want to trade uh, Do you want to trade the Uzi for one of my rifles? I have a lot of them. Or, no, um, how, how about a Glock? Do you want a Glock for the Uzi? No, that's a very... Ah, uh, come on, dude. Oh, oh, okay, what if... What if I literally give you the... Grappling hook with the rocket engine. Um, the, 
Sure, I guess you, it's easy to get guns here, so uh, here you go. Hey, let's go, let's go, yeah. Okay. So we got... Okay, guys, we got his Uzi, and we also got the normal grappling gun. I, I'm just collecting guns because um, I think that's... Are you going to play literally... for a lot more? That's really nice, look at that. Time. It's literally... It has a scope that's so cool, guys. What did you say? So I have a lot of medication out, I have a lot of uh, melon slices, I have like stacks uh, of them. Hey dude, actually, I have two tanks. I can give you one tank if you give me a lot of food. I need a lot of food, the food is the main you problem. You have a tank? Yeah, I have a tank, but it has no fuel. Where is it? Uh, I'm gonna give him the, the MK1, guys. Uh, I have a cruiser is MK1. It's like a very old tank, but it, it can run. Oh, whoa. You're giving me all these watermelons? I can give you even more for a tank, like, um, take it all. Oh, damn. Okay, okay. The minimal necessities, because uh, my friends have a lot of loot, and I don't have a lot of loot. As you can see, I just have diamond gear. You, you trust in netherite armor. That's... Yeah, that's I have a little bit of netherite armor. Get. Where do you get it from? I, uh, I, I shot a bandit for it, unfortunately. <laughs> Yeah, it is a PvP server. Dude, dude, all. here you go. Difficult. Take, take the tank. Take the tank. It's literally a good oh, exchange. Wow. Hold up, hold up. I'm gonna defend you. Oh, okay, never mind. Oh, wow, Cruiser MK1. That's, that's awesome. Thanks, guys. This guy is such a noob. I, I don't even know what to say. And there's so many zombies beside the building. Night? I don't know if they're attracted to the sound that he's making. But well, there's definitely the more night. zombies. Uh, oh yeah, let's uh, let's sleep, sleep the night. Yeah, of course. What? Uh, no, no, loot the night. We can go loot the city. Oh, uh, oh no, no, dude, you don't want to go into the city at night. Are you kidding me? We're literally gonna get mugged. There are bad players, but it's not that bad. I mean, there are two of us now. I was waiting for my friends to join me, but if you're here, we can easily just hit the town and loot up. Uh, the city has a lot of good loot, especially military campsites. Okay, let's go. It's night, uh, it's daytime already. Yeah, we don't encounter a lot of zombies these days, so... We just got so out of the fine. swamp, it's so huge. That, the swamp is safe to build a base in, you can just build a base beside ours. Oh no, I'm good, I'm good. I'm, I'm uh, doing a challenge where I have to survive on a submarine. Whoa, oh, that's... that's cool. <laughs> I don't think he's impressed, guys. Uh, yeah, I'm playing alone. I'm playing alone. Well... Either way, um, if we see any bandits, just be friendly, but if they point a gun at us, or maybe even shoot one bullet at us, just take him out, because I've encountered them players before. They pretend that they're friendly, and then instantly, it doesn't take like even a minute, they just whip out their gun, and then Oh yeah, of course, of course. You, you don't gotta tell me, I'm literally... I'm literally good. Yeah, because they will be like, oh, I'm friendly, don't shoot. And then the yeah. first chance they see you, they will be speaking over a wall. Like in some building. Oh, same. my character is I'm getting out. warm. It, it says so in the chat. So it yeah, is uh, um, warming up, I guess. They'll just say, come out, come out. And then the first moment they see you, they just shoot you. And that's, that's like a good chunk of the server. That's how they play. Yeah, I, I get it. Uh, can you also hear me okay? Because uh, my microphone, my friends say that it's not the best. I'm trying. I'm saving up for a new microphone. Oh, uh, I mean, I, I can hear you definitely fine. It's a little bit lower quality uh, than I don't know than an average microphone probably, but uh, it, it mm, works. So it works. So, so I think you're good. Bad. Yeah, um, I was just saving up for a PC, so I got a new PC, and the PC is uh, it's oh nice, pretty good. Yeah, I was thinking about downloading, like, some mods for Minecraft. Apart from the server mods, more like... Oh, shaders and mods. stuff, I get it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, like, shaders, yeah, them. Yeah, I see. Oh, we see some type of bridge or something in the distance? Yeah, maybe we can loot up. Yeah, let's see what that place is. 
I'm just the uh, guys uh, trying to play with him for a little bit to see if he's actually friendly and then I can show him my submarine because if he's not friendly that's uh no. I was mining a few days we're gonna back, find that out and I was getting pretty lucky with diamonds the server has a very good diamond spawn of race oh yeah I noticed I, I noticed you have, you have iron boots you can easily switch them out for a diamond in fact I can just give you diamond boots whenever we're back in my base oh that'd be so sick if you could yeah, I, I don't want to run around with iron boots till, uh, till, till I die. Careful, there is a charger. Got him. Look at this, there's like a... Ladder. Yeah, I see, I noticed it as well. Is this like some type of... Uh, ritual? Yeah, ritual area? Oh, whoa, you spawned in the tank. Yeah. Can I drive him? Uh, no, you need fuel for it. Oh, does it have ammunition? Can it shoot? Uh, you need ammo for it as well. Uh, I mean, you should you should have probably spawned it closer to the base. I don't know if you can pick it up. Um, let me try it with my diamond pickaxe. Oh, you're you're damaging it, I think. Yeah, I am. Huh? It's very. It's still cool. I mean, I don't really care about the tank because uh, we don't have any ammunition for it back at the base, and we don't have any fuel. Well, here it's, it's safe, I'm certain we can come back to you. So I mean, yeah, place this place project. doesn't look that populated, to be honest, so it probably is safe. Well, now that I'm playing with you, I don't want to go to bed no more. I'm like, pretty chill playing a few more hours. Are you going to be on for long? Uh, yep, I'm going to be on for a few more days, Minecraft days, that is. So a few oh. more hours. Minecraft oh, days, what is that's, that? That's weird. That's a huge highway. It is. Want to go on it? Uh, yeah, for for sure, dude. Let's check it out. The sun is going down. It's fun playing together. Um, you go, you go Discord or Skype? Ah, uh, nah, nah. I'm, I, I'm, I'm just the end game dude. Yeah, we, we can be, we can add each other. I'm pretty sure on the server on the system. Is there a system? A friend system on the server? Uh, you can whisper. I will just write your name down. Oh, uh, okay, yeah. This server is pretty vanilla in some retrospects. Like, there's no teleports, no, it's, no actual it's like a, class. A, 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 who told you, by the way, of the server? It's not, uh, I just it's found it. I, I just found it. You just found it? Yeah. Really? Because uh, it's a community grown server from a Discord server, so I, just, I like, have no clue of, what he said, guys. But uh, we just kind uh, of played I, I think together. He's, uh, he's saying um, the server is difficult to find. I don't know. I just found it in the server list. We just kind of play as a team, and we don't really. Oh, look at that! There is a chicken. Kind of Damn, guys, this guy is so boring. You, you can get, you can get it. That if you want to, you yep. got, you got enough food. You got enough food. Yeah, I do. You should meet my friends, because my friends are also way friendlier than me. I'm like kind of just quietly always playing with them. But oh no, you're friendly, you're friendly. It's real fun to play with you, dude. Don't don't even fret about it. Uh, Wanna get if, these zombies? If Justin was online, uh, he'd probably give you like a lot of loot and a lot of tips because he's been playing with the server admins, he knows them, he knows all of their projects. And this is this server, it's gonna be live only for like a couple of months, and then they're gonna switch out the mod pack totally to a completely different one. Oh, I get it, I get it. I mean, it's cool, I guess. This, this server is cool, I like it. Yeah, uh, it's hardcore awesome. survival for groups and solo players and you just get to experience Minecraft from a completely different direction like of course of course fan wars. it's not pvp fashion. hold up hold up it's let me check the trunk nor hardcore it's more just kind of sticking to the roots of minecraft like old school if you bro take a cookie like take a cookie and i don't know hey, eat thanks. it guys he thanks. talks so much we got a charger yeah, we got a lot of variety of zombies here also. Um, the server is... You should join. Have you played the Battle Royale version of the server? Uh, no. Oh, well, there was a Battle Royale before the zombie server was created, and that's 
probably where most of the players come from. Yeah, that was a charger, you probably can't move. Uh, yeah. Um, most people play from the Battle Royale server, and that's primarily the main population of the server right now. So, you're a newbie if you joined, like, recently. We've been playing for four days already, making a lot of progress. It's, we played on the Battle Royale server. But you can join our clan, by the way. Dude, there are so many zombies, you better run. Dude, we're getting swarmed by zombies. This is not good. I'm gonna reload the AK. I am getting swarmed. Are you are you good? Are you good? We we nearly got them all. We nearly got them all. Just a few more. Oh, hold up, hold up. There we go. We got them. We got them. Let's yeah, let's get out cool. of this place. Let's go, go, go quickly. Yeah, let's go. I, I was gonna say actually that. You we should probably get to the city, maybe. Oh, my bad, my bad. I mean, I, I don't think we're gonna make it, to be honest. It's really far away. Oh, we can definitely make it. Dude, dude, yeah, let's go, let's go to my submarine, actually. Is your submarine close to you here? Hold up, hold up. Maybe I will die here. This is really dangerous. Okay, you got it, you got it. Thanks. Go, go, go. Just run. Run. Forget about the zombies. Uh, my submarine is literally way back in the swamp. Let's let's go get it, to be honest, because I think it's literally still going to be faster than getting it on the, to the city by foot. I pretty much know where we are. It's really far away still, and I, I'm doing a challenge. I'm doing a challenge to survive in the submarine. So I, I gotta go get it back, dude. It's real unfortunate. Yeah, I'm gonna follow you. I'm just gonna follow you, so you can do whatever. I'm just gonna follow you, right? Yeah. Okay. Then, uh, you you wanna sleep over over uh right here? You mean you mean not sleep, but just wait over the night? Yeah. Um, do you have anything to block block this place? I mean, I do. One you can piece move. of wood. Dude, move, move. One piece of wood. Okay, I think we're good. I, I think they literally can't climb to us. It's, so we're... We're going to stay here, wait till um, sun, sun up sometime, and then we can just wait here at night. And I think yeah. okay. I'm going to grab a coffee, because I'm feeling a little, a little dizzy. I'm supposed to be sleeping, but I'm playing. Oh, all good, all good, bro. Of course, of course. Uh, let's wait over the night. This is it. You see it? Oh, I see it, I see it. It's, it's a little big. I kind of like it. Yep, it's pretty big. It's pretty big. This is my home. I've literally been traveling across the whole map and visiting all the locations with this submarine. So you know, like, pretty good base going. I kind of like it. I kind of like it. It's like a I base, mean, but it's, it's a boat base. Because you're a friendly guy, I can just give you a gift. Like, come here, come here. You need, yeah. you need to get this. Yeah. Here. Oh, 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 dude, thanks. Thanks so much. I, re I remember you told me you were going to get me those boots. Wait, you gave me you gave me your own boots? Yeah, Bro, I, I can't do own. that. Take mine. Take take my iron I boots. Can, I have more. I have, I have way more diamonds back at the base. Bro, I mean, this is not thank you so much for, uh, you know, I coming with me to my you. submarine and, uh, you know, defending me on the way. Uh, if you want, you know what, dude? Come here, I'm gonna give you a parting gift. A parting gift? Are we, are we parting ways already? Because we just started playing together, we should play some more. Dude, I, I, I hate to do this, but you're a friendly guy, I'm gonna I'm gonna let you go. And... What, what, what? You're not gonna kill me, are you? No, no, <laughs> what? Come on, dude, don't, 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 don't play it. I'm joking, wow. Okay, okay, yeah, you're joking. I get it. I get uh, your humor uh, now a little bit, but dude, I'm gonna give you. You got a good base. You got a good base, and you got some good loot, bro. I, I can see that you're currently carrying all of your loot in your backpack and on yourself. No, it's I'm actually all in the submarine, to be honest. 
Oh, yeah. Well, I'm traveling light, no backpack, because the backpack makes people go after you more. So it's. Oh, yeah, that's so smart. Yeah. That's so smart, dude. If you didn't notice, none of the bandits never had any backpacks because the backpack is like for sports during a lot of loot, and that automatically means you're a bandit. So I was very wary of you when you just appeared. Uh, so I was just thinking, what is this guy's deal? He has okay, so because of my backpack, inside. you literally thought I was a bandit carrying a lot of loot. Okay, I get yeah, it, I get it. Uh, thank you for not shooting me then. But dude, dude, here you go. I'm gonna give you a parting gift. It's literally an Uzi. It's your right. own Uzi. I know uh, I have a lot of guns, and you know what? To be honest, they're literally all worse than than your Uzi. So I'm gonna let you have it. It's like a gift. So I gave yeah. you a lot of stuff for free, to be honest. Yep, that's right, that's uh, right. You give my Uzi back, I'm so thankful. Yeah, no problem, dude, no problem. I mean, uh, I'm gonna be on my way with my submarine. Uh, I'll see you about. I, I know where your base is. Uh, sure. I can come visit sure. any time, to be honest. Sure. Tyler, okay. Um, we, we have each other's contacts, so we can always play together. And me and the boys will probably play tomorrow. If you want to play tomorrow, we can play again. Oh, yeah, for sure, dude, for sure. Okay, he he left. Let's, uh, let's go back to the submarine. We are back in the base, and I also have a lot of loot, like zombie heads, red sleeping bags. I've got uh, some stuff I can put around the base. I also have turrets. I think I will place the turrets really far away from the entrance, so this was like a death tunnel. So if anyone comes in, they will literally get just automatically blasted by these turrets, and they can't break them. Let's break this barbed wire. Uh, place the turret. Place another turret. Okay, perfect. So these guys, they will literally shoot zombies and any enemy players that come in and are not part of my team. And look at this, guys. This is literally the POV. You go down, boom. Bar with wire, you cannot hide anywhere. And you got these two turrets that really blend in with the cobblestone walls. And they're just, they're aiming, they're targeting, they're scanning for players. And we also got zombie heads. We can, oh, you know what? We can place them right here. Oh, we got three zombie heads, okay. I don't really know what to do with these guys, they're like collectibles, you could say. If if a player, or, a, or if a bandit goes down and he literally sees these heads, he may get distracted by them, thinking they're zombies, he's gonna, he's gonna shoot them, waste a little bit of time, get my turrets to uh, fire more shots at him, give my turrets more time to shoot him. But uh, it is nighttime also, and we are in the middle of the ocean, as you can see. So we did part ways with that friendly feller that we found in the swamp. He was pretty friendly, but you know what? He didn't seem like he knew much about the game, so it was pretty difficult to just let him go. So I, I, I decided to actually give him back his Uzi, because I don't know if uh, guns are an issue for him. So uh, yeah, just to be safe, be a friendly guy, I gave him back all the weapons he gave me. But uh, it is nighttime, and one thing about this night is... I think it's the last night, guys. When I sleep, it's gonna be day 100, and the challenge will be complete. So, I think we did we, we, we did a lot of stuff, to be honest. We got the base pimped out. We got a... We met so many friendly people, so many bandits, fought so many people, and we also visited, visited so many locations with the submarine. So, yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and sleep. I'll see you guys when it's daytime. Okay, this is it guys. We just survived 100 days in the submarine in the zombie apocalypse If you enjoyed this video then subscribe to the channel down below if you haven't already done So leave a like under the video and also leave a comment if you have any suggestions for a new 100 days video This was uh, pretty different from my usual videos because I recorded on a server with uh, other people and because of that we actually found a lot of bandits a lot of friendly players a lot of clans random players it was pretty difficult to uh it was a lot more tense to go into the cities because of that because we're playing on a server so if if you want to see more uh videos where i survive on a server with other people around me then uh, leave that in the comments most definitely because i don't know it's a little bit more difficult to record but if you guys enjoy it then i will record it even more so uh yeah this is it for this video if you enjoyed it then click the next one guys i'll see you next time.